<laughs> My leg keeps falling off. <laughs> Curse it. Oh. My leg. Why must you be this way? Let's try this again. I want to mind his business and just. I've been too busy. Ah, good morning, you drunkard. It's morning. How are you? I don't know. How's the hangover? Yeah, you know, it's oh, over. Is he like a, he waxes it and huh. I believe he has a. You know, I've seen him that is much. Over I, I actually can't believe that. I, whenever I drink that much, I'm on the floor for like three well, fucking days. I didn't drink that much, and I didn't sleep either, so you know. You chugged my whole bottle of rum. That wasn't full. What are you talking about? Uh, that was a full bottle. No, it fucking wasn't. What are you talking about? My apologies, Captain. I drank quite a bit. <laughs> you drank really fast. A lot of the students are alcoholics. That's how we cope with our lives. It, these, these poor, you poor, poor people. Like we are, oh, yeah. we are okay. okay. The on the sea for years and months and stuff so like that, and we don't even drink that much. Mm. Oh. Remind me again. Okay. Uh, the mustache. I speak for yourself, I'm Captain. Your name. <laughs> Captain. Hey. Monty. Monty Monty, that's right. I don't want people drunk on my boat while we're working on things. If I see one of you fall for that crow's nest, I'll have your neck. If your legs aren't broken. Ah, uh, old Jim was fine. And if I he only broke a bone or two. Professor Stein. Poor Jim, boo. And Professor Wait Huffy. for Godfrey. Old Jim. Very much, uh... Every time I'm just gonna go back go. in. God damn. <laughs> see what's, uh... Nope. Morning. Morning. Been quiet. What is Uncle Phil? Okay. So. Sitting down for a break. Oh uh, yeah, it was a very <laughs> long walk going out there and back in here. You know, so I got I got to rest my legs, you know. Ah, of course, yes. Sea life is quite uh quite exhausting. You have to balance yourself ever so often. I I, I can feel that it's very wobbly. <laughs> ah, yes. Ah, greetings. <laughs> I see that there are already some morning morning birds here. <laughs> Good to have of you. Course. Ah. How is uh, how is everything going? Have we arrived yet? Uh, it didn't look like it. Still lots of water. Uh, well then, by all means, <laughs> don't mind me joining you too. <laughs> okay. uh, how has your night been? Hope it's been uh, refreshing. I understand sea weather can get to some people, but you know. Um, it was pretty normal, I guess. Cause. You know. Yeah, that's fair. Normal is better than bad, so. <laughs> hey, I mean, if you're, you're lack of sleep, you know. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. It's true. Understandable. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning fellas. Morning. Good morning, Good morning, Captain. Hope everything we'll is going according to plan. Shortly. Well, I keep that. Ah, really? wonderful to hear. I can hope. Wait. Yes, oh. the boat is moving. Madam Rosewood. Ah. All right. <laughs> Are we sure this time? Wait. <laughs> it is 100% moving. It has been moving for the past few weeks. That is good to know. And actually, just like yesterday, I, I will check it will just moving. in case. I will check. You can check. Constantly updates our opinion maps. Softened. Yeah, usually we have to Okay, I think we're moving. Mm. Oh, oh, oh yeah, we were moving. I could feel that! 
Yep, 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 yep. I know, it's a bit strange, but we make do. <laughs> well, you can see the wind in my hair. It's so beautiful. Let's just say there are competing ideologies at play. Oh. That's like... That's... That's quite I'm similar to... I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Is it not? Oh, oh God, that was a... <laughs> I can confirm. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Hope the night has been refreshing to all of you. Oh no, Fushi. My fellow teammate. I didn't, I didn't mind the nice night crisp air while I was on my uh, little uh, scouting expedition around. But everything was quiet. Is Lean well? I slept pretty nicely, yes. Just Did I sleep well? I, uh, yeah, sleeping in the, 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 the cross nest is fun. I mean, we should I, be I assume you've got some better than staying. Uh, is there anything better than staying in the bedrooms? Over the night, perhaps between internal talks. Yeah, because you, you really fucked up that thing. <laughs> like nothing that I think we recall. Really fucked it uh, up. I, the the last of line, so. I mean, it's my job. I'm too. Yeah, but still, the crimson lady like, wasn't spotted anyway, I would assume you would so <laughs> sit up for a day before you fucking headlock the fucking thing. That is definitely good to know. And of course, your wine is... No! So at the island we can you put something in the full Nelson if you care about it, obviously. I don't know. True. True. Red wine. <laughs> Anything my own crimson get you a lady bit, uh... has disappeared. <sighs> <laughs> at least I didn't really get badly hurt. Might need that. That's the, uh, bright side of it all. Yeah, I mean, you're still walking, you still have both your feet How are you not... How are you not nearly as cold as... How about yourself? How did you sleep? For... Oh, my for... sleep was... Hey. I'm not Morning. gonna lie, I'm not always, uh... Oh, you know what, fair enough. As it is a gift still, but yeah, I, I forget was... that. I'm, I'm, so, so a, I'm, I'm a hairy fella. It is, really furry. Uh, during the night, uh, one of my cabin neighbors was quite the uh, snoring one. I'm not sure. I wish. One of the, Nothing wrong with that. One of the crew. Hey, no, you just, you just gotta grow a little bit, you know? Just, you like, let it loose. The only thing keeping me warm are my muscles. <laughs> <laughs> my heart's <laughs> warm <laughs> muscles. <laughs> well, we'll be in a better quarter soon. I can assure you, you will be warm. Yeah, well, I have some warm. Waiting for it to settle in. We have a dedicated servant on the island. Or anything? Oh, you know, I, I have a longer sleep gambeson. Yes, and as we briefly talked about yesterday, we have our own farm. I never wear a long sleep gambeson. Yeah. Mm. Do you need, like, a jacket? I think we have some few extras. It's understandable. I'm, I'm perfectly fine. It's just cold. Did All right, here we go, Whisper. Whisper. I do hope that once we do arrive on the island, mm. that we can, you know, investigate the whole agriculture thing as well as, you know, the guy. I am, of course, I'm always interested in how you're faring with <laughs> such things. I wonder how long you'll still be on this boat for. Tired of sea travel. I mean, at the end of the day, I'll yeah. <laughs> try to find a Don't either. I always have rock hard muscles to keep me warm. I'm just hairy. In its entirety. Morning, Emma. Morning. Yeah. Morgan's up and walking again. Ship travel can be quite exhausting. Oh, good Morgan. When you're doing nothing. Yeah. It's very DC out there. We can, okay, we're just gonna phase and do it. You to join us. We don't fight, I promise. I know, I know, it's fine. I, I was just uh, walking about because I'm. I really need to get off this boat, so I'm trying to <laughs> distract myself. Try to follow you. I see. Are you, um. <laughs> Have you stomached some breakfast this morning? Oh yeah, yeah, I did. Oh, God, I heard a sound. I'm sorry. <laughs> God, that scared me. <laughs> but yeah, I, I have eaten. I ate when I when I got out of bed. I guess. I, I mean, you good? Low ceilings. Oh. Good morning, Lieutenant. <laughs> morning. Morning. I'm going to you, you gotta stay on use your knees. To stay on this gotta bow plane. down a little bit something. Wait, yeah. Just woke up. Mm -hmm. Like scarf. <laughs> like well, I asked Miss Anatas here what she was looking forward to the most being back on the island. Jackson. What about you all? Am I interrupting something? Oh no, no, you're not. You're good. Mm. 
the way he was looking. But he would. So I being cold. Saying I took his scarf. And maybe I did. Mm. It was a really no. nice scarf. <laughs> it's all right. Okay. Seen something you like? Mm. Okay. Mm. Apparently. Ah. Oh god, he's floating. Oh, you, oh, you got I, Captain. Oh, we have a staff of Mazari. Oh. Her native to the island. They Madari. look after our, uh, our needs. Yes, they're provided with housing and protection, and in return, they serve us. I understand understandable trade agreement, so if it's for protection and housing, absolutely. I can fully support this. I've not seen it Madari in quite some time, so this would probably be a pleasant visit. Don't in my hair. Why would it? Now I need to take this out of curiosity. I think the ears are flowing too. I think I'm beginning to spot some land in the distance. Some angles. <laughs> Land. I see water. Can I? I no. All oh, right, we're on a moving <laughs> object. I can't use it. Dang it! Some <laughs> amazing beer. But, uh, still, if you excuse me, I will, um, perhaps take a small look at the, uh, cargo that is still on top of the back, so, hope you do not mind me. Keep track of that beast. Oh no, everybody's yeah. floating. Oh no! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's that famous iceberg that killed the Titanic! Water water. <laughs> wow! We use that bucket for many things. I look, it's the first piece of land. It's a massive rock. Wow, a rock! Better than nothing. Yeah. That's not a rock, that's ice. I'm seeing trees. Oh, trees. Not a rock. It's a boulder. Oh. That's not a boulder, it's just a block of ice. I, I, I read it in a book once, just... Yeah, fair enough. Oh shit, I see a tower. I see a tower. Ah, looks like we're finally coming into port. Home sweet home! We'll be making it close, men! Can't wait to step on Gaia's soil, soil again. <laughs> I've been getting quite sick of ship rides for my sake. Oh, excuse me, one step on Gaia? Oh, dirt! Dirt! <laughs> what a step on Gaia? God damn, girl. Damn! She! I'm very much looking forward to being home. Land ahoy! <laughs> I guess then, for the time being, I guess I should be happy as well, for I guess this is now my home for the time being as well. <laughs> yes? I wasn't told about no Main front sales have been closed. Ah, look, I guess where there's already a small greeting. <laughs> well, that's the protective measure that, uh... Who? Who did? Oh, oh Delta! You more than tell you. Oh, okay. Remember that thing I couldn't tell you the last time we talked? Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Is this magical created by <laughs> Aethertech? Oh Aethertech? Understood. At first I was expecting uh, more runic magic, you know, self-protection of the island itself, but Aethertech, this is more than I just I thought impressive. you had bought a new jacket. Fascinating, even. <laughs> oh, look at that. Ah, and there's <laughs> our welcome party. Drop it! Right. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> not here. Maybe a little bit more. Bring it up a welcome, little bit. Welcome, Hope you have a safe destination to the Rosewood Academy. God, I forgot how much his voice carries. Welcome, welcome. Who would, welcome. Uh, ask, who would that be? Oh, oh doesn't even work back. Uh, yeah, yeah, sad. Oh, ah, the small Bombadil. bikey on the back. Guys. Ah, okay. And this is Professor Mordred here. Finally. Mordred. Okay, okay. Was... What would he be? That's amazing. Come on, the school is around here. The students are excited, but please, please. Well, maybe I'll let you explain okay. it yourself. Cool. Oh, we go. Everyone be careful. Now. Get off. Yeah. Be safe. Yeah. We've arrived. Because right. of you as well, Sky. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Cold. Oh, God. Uh, careful. Uh, yeah. 
glad to Ooh. finally be back. Mm. Ah. Welcome back. Uh, welcome back. Water. I'm a I see. Ah, by the flesh is not hey, scary, yeah, man. I'm home. Hopefully oh, yes, Hello! Oh! Hello! Hello! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> 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 Hello! 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 It's it's my it's yeah, I'm getting my wild spirit out. Lawyer, he's listen. He's yeah. been obsessive over this whole lawyer spirit shit. I don't know where this came from. Ah, uh. it came from within. within you know, some son. have it, some don't. It is what it is. Sucks to suck. Where are they at? Oh, no. There they are. They're still on the boat. They're yeah. still on the boat. Get the fuck out the boat. Oh, shit, are we supposed to be there? I have no idea. Oh my god, I didn't realize that many people well, left. If you're gonna do much oh, wait, no. Carry, it's people helping them. Carrying, then no, we all fucking left. What you talking about? Yeah. I don't know how oh, hey, you're back. Hey! Sorry. I'm, glad you I'm not dead! Hey, what's up? Yeah, I'm not I, dead! I assumed as much. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm glad to see you're not dead. That looks, not dead looks good on you. I'm very curious the style I'm trying to keep. Oh, it was so peaceful that I kind of forgot about their existence. A little bit. <laughs> well, no, no, I just don't like to see. Hello, Professor. No, I was um. No, should we see? Should we help carry the I mean, the, than, the know, thing? Uh, the past, however long. So that thing. I mean, I could I offer. Don't know. Morning. Morning. Yeah. So I don't really. Uh, hey guys. Ah, uh, Benny. Yo. Benny. Sorry. Oh, so. I just... <laughs> really, really long. Oh, God, people are really so going in. Uh, run? <laughs> yeah, we sprinted from Aqua to... Hi! 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 You can take a breath. <laughs> you know, right? I'm gonna get yelled at by Caden if I take a breath. Speaking of... We'll catch up. I'll be... Captain? I'll be back. Alright! Do we hey, help Emma. carry the damn thing? I haven't offered help yet, but we can... I'm sure... Yeah, go ahead and ask. Oh, you mean the crates of the... Of the... No, I mean the, the, the thing. Right. Yes. I will ask the Chancellor. Oh, the thing! Yeah, the thing! Hi, the, the thing. Alright, he's going. Good morning. We'll see ya. You might want to move here. Hurry, so hurry Kaylin's holding all the weight on that. Uh, drop it in for a sec. We're not going to be putting it, are we? We got these help with the luggage? Yes, I'm on the top side. Yeah, I don't know what I was getting at. I don't know. Are we putting it over here? Yeah, I feel like they've kind of got this sort of thing in the way. Okay. Just probably explosive. I'm gonna do it. They're bringing it up there. They're bringing it up. Okay. Okay. All right. Explosives. Okay. Ruin. Yeah, they've got it sorted. Look at that. It's gonna take about an hour probably to get in the way. Fuck no, I got this. Not thinking about. Probably better to get the big guys to take the thing. Did I just see Mama jump into the boat? Yeah. Should we? We head inland back to the oh, elsewhere. <laughs> El elsewhere, what here? I wish we're not actually sure what we're supposed to be doing. So I have absolutely no clue. We should form a small nice. crowd to the right, five boats for the sake of cargo. Uh, Alright. So, so are we responsible we're for fine the here. I just Good mean in the walkway there. Good morning, Morgan. Technically, actually, the, the captain is in the way of the... Good morning. Oh, yeah, we got, I was about to say, are we responsible for the thing, or do we need bigger guys to get the thing? I tried to, I tried to get him down. You know what? I could. I'm trying to get the chance to pin down. I was just asking, Professor. Yeah, yeah. 
I don't think happening here. Yeah. <sighs> oh, oh no, yeah, they, they're going for it. Yes, Good go. Uh, uh, you know what? It's really okay to take a little relax. I mean, we have to capture the damn thing by ourselves. So, you know what? I think it's okay. Zoning out a lot. Hey, Talia! Oh, I think they do oh, a shit. What are you doing? I will stand by in case it escapes. That's actually a very good idea. Sounds good to me. We I mean, already got it once. Let's see if we can catch it twice. Out of there somehow. We beat the shit out of it. I know I will try. Oh, you got it. If you can headlock it one time, you can headlock it too. Is there anything we can do to help? Uh, uh, I guess that's for the science people to figure out? I don't know. I don't really thought about it. Maybe in the dungeon? Ah, uh, Terra, we are allowed to leave the dock. And, and you're sure that's a good idea when that... Uh, okay. Oh, yes. Yeah. I'm gonna stay here, just in case. It'll be fine. I mean, it's one Rift Beast versus all of us. I think it'll be okay if it does I'll get out somehow. <laughs> This is incredible. Should I borrow my Fuck. weapon? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Ah, it'll be alright. I'm just being cautious. I'd rather not have any mistakes occur. Oh, I understand. I certainly hope the construction of the rest of the facility is not as poorly maintained as this dock. If you don't watch yourself, you might fall between the sides. Bring it to the arena. Once it's off the ship and on the dock, probably. Of course. Uh, I believe Zuko is currently up there. I'll grab the weapon. Would you like? I think it'll be fine. You think? I think they got it. Yes. I'm just wondering why we didn't use that. That would like have made like a little bit easier, but. I don't think you can support the weight of a giant cage like that. Maybe? Might. I mean, there. maybe, maybe not. And we just need one more, I mean, one more of that. It? it was big. Okay, I, I don't, I think that, maybe a, two cannons might be its weight capacity. Is it? If Morgan can one-handedly headlock the fucking thing, then I'm sure that one can carry it as well. Okay, but there's a difference between Morgan and, uh, Wooden post. We we gotta construct a better post. Maybe. Good to see you. I'm good to see you too. And I I like your style. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. It's getting really cold. Oh yeah. I I can kind of feel under my toe beans, but it is what it is. Whoa. Well, I almost slipped. It is very slippery. <laughs> I do not want to fall into this water oh, yeah, no, now. It's, no, it's, it's cold. You're gonna freeze. I don't know. Sir Malik just went for a swim. I love Malik. He's a mad lad. I think he can warm himself up. That's where the fire comes from, right? Eh. <laughs> Hold on. Is is Caden just carry? Oh no, he is with the rest. Okay. It looked like he was carrying it as for a minute there. Yeah, I don't, I, I'm saying mm. we need a better one of those post thingies that we could take them from above because right now they've been carrying it t down two pair of stairs. Maybe, maybe we just need to like put a crane on the boat. You'll be a tragedy. What? I need to stop flipping. <laughs> you falling into water will be a tragedy. Yeah. That, but also so. if they accidentally drop the cage into the water. Oh, I swear to God, if we need to go and fucking capture another one. Don't jinx it. Okay, then, there's boxes behind you. Okay. Watch out behind you. Welcome to Rosewood. Zuku, why are you underneath it? Please don't be underneath it. It's... Here, here, Zuku, I got you. Sorry. It's hard to navigate. Uh, you, here. I got this on the other side. Oh, watch out for the roof. Okay. Oh, the roof. Oh, no. 
Remember, turn, turn, turn. Oh, yeah, there's not much wiggle in the water. Oh, there you go. Look out for stairs. Also freezing. You will freeze before you get back to the boat. There must be a more efficient way of doing this, right? A better pole. A, a better crane. Oh, did it just growl at us? Oh, yeah, it's growling. It's been growling the whole fucking time. Why is it? Oh no! It's it's alive. What do you expect? Like docile? Did you not stick it with drugs? No. Can you stick it with drugs? I don't, I don't know. We didn't. We just you know tied it up and uh. popped it in a box. Pop goes to rift Are you fed it? What? Sorry, what? Have you fed the thing? Uh, I mean, I, I have been, I, I've been looking after the chains and make sure that they were chained up and stuff, that it didn't escape on the fucking boat. That's what I've been doing. I know who's been taking care of feeding it. Of course, of course. Please. I have not. Do these things even need food? Hey, I mean, no kind of like assume they just kill us. Yeah, I think that's what it's as well. But it's a, it's a joy to arrive. You know, I think that might be a reason why we, you know, captured it, well, it figure it out ah, a bit more. Words of Madame Rosewood as well. That's fair. So, it's gonna be a what might uh, the discussion be here about? Uh, uh, does it eat? Um, can we drug it? Um, so, if I might ask, since the cargo is that black, take care of it. What are you the 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 what are you brief beast. Well, oh, you guys know about it? My I thought we were supposed to keep it a secret. Oh, okay, no, never mind then. It's, it's crawling the whole way. Well, oh. well, well, before anything else, I would like to congratulate you. I'm quite interested to see what you've caught. Tell me, tell me, tell me, before you, before anything else, tell me. Uh, Was it scary? Was it big? Was it bigger than any of the vi ones we've fought before? Oh no, it was fairly small, but it was fucking hefty. Uh, Morgan fucking headlocked it, uh, one man, while the others were trying to chain it up. Real, real hefty one. Really fucking oh, well, famous. Uh, no, but it's still, is it still a quite a fearsome one? Is it still, if, 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 will it still, like, scare the, the heck out of the common folk, as they say? Uh, most likely, yeah. I mean, so far people have been uh, reluctant by going up there to it while it was crawling in the box. Uh, besides the new students, they've been a little bit too curious for my liking. Perfect, Well, experiment with this, with this creature is going to be very well exciting, don't you agree, uh, Emma? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, is it cold right now? Why am I not wearing my coat? Oh, I, I don't uh, know, sir. Cold. You, you yeah. probably should be. Uh, sorry, I left Andrew. it in the dorms. Yeah. Don't worry about Emma, it. We are to tail the crate as it heads in land. Oh shit, okay, so we are gonna make sure it doesn't escape. Cool. Someone uh, took my gun. Do you mind if I join you guys? Uh, sure, go ahead. I guess. Our castle? Mm. We need a Morgan. It makes you feel better. Actually, Emma, you're fast. I'm fast. You don't have to. Where did you say the dawn? Wait, we're taking. I thought we're taking it to the arena. Why we're taking it to the dawn? No, not the dawns. Morgan might have headed to the dawn. Oh yeah, I think. I think Morgan is at the dawn. They said they were going. No, we're, okay. Morgan went to the dorm, we're taking that doesn't to the matter. arena. Doesn't matter, we have this, guys. It's fine. She's fine. Let her have a off. Ignis and Umbra will be taking the Rift Beast to the arena. You are not to teleport it there. It is too big. Walk it to the arena, please. I'm seeing a lot of awesome holding that box. Yeah, I need more people on this tower. Sir, there's a con there was a conflict sure in the north. Uh, and Ignis. Uh, Ignis or Umbra. I don't see you here, no Aqua. I mean, might as well, because so far Aqua is doing all the work from Umbra. Probably gonna wake it up if they're not. Uh, okay. I am a bit concerned about the stairs, though. Uh, they already tore it down like a couple of stairs, they'll be fine. Yeah, I know. 
Ah, of course not. And uh, you are interested in seeing... Yeah, then Bombadil can do whatever Bombadil's gonna do. Alright, careful. It's bumper mm. things. All right, left or right, left or right. Man, it was, I can't are we just leaving it in the arena? I, I'm so far, I think we're leaving it in the arena. Now, now, don't take it to the teleporter. Meanwhile, I'll be taking the teleporter. Such devices would be fit for a teleporter, I do have to say. They told you to not take it. Okay. No, they're listening. They're going. Good question. <laughs> Is it always so? Just keep moving. Just keep moving. Actually, that's a smaller idea. Right. Uh, We're coming right. at an angle. We should take the right. Take the right. Keep moving. At least the charm of youth is not lost on all of you. I am impressed. We're almost there. Use yourself. I think it's most of the container. Okay. Joyous in the way you're handling oh, things. I'm nah, he wished it was the container. <laughs> 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 mm. Okay. We're almost there. Oh, I should not have been almost there. Oh, fuck. I almost feel like we should have dragged it. Not almost there. You're maybe halfway now. No, too loud. Also, should pop the hinges off. Shifting lap. I would have just tried to rope around. Careful for them, students. We installed wheels on the cage. Okay. Hmm. I mean, we invented the wheel. Yeah, did you install wheels on it? Because I wouldn't. Okay. Maybe not put wheels on it, but what about this? We take a board and put wheels on the board. Then we can put the box on the board with the wheels. So don't be worried if they all come right up. It had to be a pretty strong board for it to not break though, right? did not think about the idea, but... Uh, it didn't need to be like a really strong board or a piece of metal. That way we can take it off and on and still roll it. That way it's not constantly on wheels. Emma, do you have weapons at the moment? I do not, someone stole it. Well, I guess you have to still carry it up the stairs though, right? Oh yeah, you still gotta carry it upstairs, but still, you don't have to carry it on flat ground. Was that the sword that was laying around, Emma? That's true. No, I don't think so. I think I left my sword here. I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh, how you do, Lefer? You've been running every morning, like I told you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, as much as I can be. Yeah. Uh, good, 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 good. I can't blame me not for running every day, but. No, no, I told you every day, even if it was a little bit. I told you every day. I gotta have to test you tomorrow. <laughs> oh boy. Repeat that again. I need to watch out. Oh yeah. It doesn't matter how fast I run. You'll run faster than me anyway. Listen, I'm so taking down the speed to make sure that you keep up. The point is that you just get that leg working. That's the whole point with this. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so this is the arena. Oh, fascinating. Combat rounds. We've got a larger building up to the left. Oh, yeah, there it goes. Hold the door. 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 Hold the Oh god. He's good on us in it. Set it there for now. And more. Three, and don't disturb it, please. One. Can we take it, please, take it into the arena? Emma. That's me. I mean, you don't have weapons, you can... Just letting you know, anything happens, keep your distance, okay? That's fine, I'm, I'm just... I'm, I'm just you can look out for Bernie, that's all. Okay. For who? Bernie, I named it. Oh, okay. Yeah. You name the Rip Beast? Yeah. 
I mean, right now it's just a box, but... I wouldn't get it. Actually, maybe we can't find it. Tara? Tara? I would like you to come front and center. We want to thank you for your hard work. And you're going to need to give a debrief and a report to the other students. It's man. It will. Of course, Mark is still not here. Oh. oh no. I'm gonna crash. Oh yeah, just waiting. Let's give it a hot minute. I'm crashing. <laughs> Me. One catch up. Oh. Okay. Holy that shit. That was a serious one. That was a really big oh, one. Okay, Did you? Okay, everyone just hold. Just hold. Everyone hold. I think it's the cap. It's the step six. It's the step Holy. Holy. Fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. I was terrified. It was just the flux. How did we survive? Holy shit. God damn. Everyone's fine, oh, nobody's gonna throw anything. Crazy. Yeah, I didn't you know they could pause time. Yeah, we're living! Cool. Okay, we're oh gonna, shit! Okay, just give, it okay. give it a second. Okay. Give it a second. Alright, let's go... I had a heart attack. Make sure it doesn't get out. Anyways, God damn, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, uh, yeah. Terra's been called up front, uh, from... Yeah. Uh, fuck. I'm gonna go check with her. Hello, Madari. I wouldn't assume anything less. Which one? Which kind? Something similar all students, back. all of you, line up. Students line up. We want Terra to give a presentation. All students line up on the far side of the arena. To my right. Oh, yeah, you guys are making oh, this quite exciting. Right. All yeah. students quite line up to my right. I'm not really part of the uh, students. I really don't. I think I it's a little eccentric. But a bit. what am I to say? Yeah, am I to judge? No. Students. Well, they can they. Well, if they manage to capture uh, it, uh, could we sure like write it yeah, down on a piece of paper or something? Um, you know. All right, Gilligan, it's time to show off your achievements. Your team you worked hard for it. Right. Now make it shine. Is it me giving it shit? <coughs> or is it? Should yes, you should have to give the presentation. Lucia, just now. If you have a volunteer for your team, that's fine. Yes, thank you. Right. You're the team lead. You want to go? Come, students. Push back a bit. No, go ahead. Okay. Students, Actually, where don't is be shy, the gather room? up. We have no clue. I think they ran off. I think they visit the room. I thought this was, I thought it was a good distance. Uh, Skyad, I have to go find uh, Morgan. She seems to be missing. Probably right, the dorms. Alright. She's Wait, over there. Hmm? Oh, is she? Oh. Nice, I'm students. This is an important day. Yes. Okay, I'm sorry. We have captured a rift beast. This truly is a red letter day. A turning point, one might say. I'm very proud of Terra to give us this gift so that we can study it. Terra, are you ready to present? I, I'm so close. <laughs> okay, we'll just see this off the top. Um, hi, everyone. Thank, thank you, ma'am. Uh, yes, so the debrief of the mission, ma'am. Yes, of course, the debrief of the mission. I want right. to let them know how well you got on. So, uh, hi, it's really great to be back. Anyway, uh, let's see, we got on the ship. I was informed by the Chancellor, other professors, um, to keep it hush hush at the time, but that we would be capturing a Rift Beast on our way back. Oh no, not again! Oh, oh. fucking god. Way back, we took a... We took a swing by Kenvale. Um... After we disembarked there, we de we deployed, you know, after we set up. We split into two teams. Uh, Lieutenant Ivine here took half of Terra, I took the other half, uh, with the help of the professors. Um, Professors Skyet, and my team would have set a trap, which we, we did. Uh... Irene and Professor Takuya led the uh, bait, shall we say, as ahead of time we'd scouted a suitable target. To kill you now. Inside of that cage is what we know as a mover, the ones that spit acid at several of us at Canvale. Oh, okay. Um, 
the timer wasn't as accurate as we would have liked, but as you can see, we all made it through. Um, eventually got it down. Morgan here. <laughs> uh, wrapped her arms around the beast's neck and pinned it to the floor. The rest of us helped. Uh, got its maw shut. Um, tied it down as best we could. And disabled any way that it might be able to escape its bonds. After we were done with that... You know what I realized? I should be talking louder. After we were done with that, we <laughs> had some light pursuit. I'm not sure <laughs> if it is this, but whatever noise the beast was making seemed to attract attention of its uh, friends. And because of that, we had a few flyers coming in after us, uh, spitting acid as well. But light pursuit overall, uh, nothing we couldn't handle. Um, as we got back to the shoreline, the new one sorted uh, made a rather formidable defense. Um, and showed their metal in the face of the danger. They were rather fearless. Was... Uh... Oh, fuck. Weapons out! Oh my fucking god. What the hell? Get it out? now. Weapons out, attack! Oh, no. I was not prepared for this! Rangers to the back line! <clears throat> <laughs> Defenders up ahead. Anyone if we need to kill it, we are killing it. Holy Jesus fuck, Christ. Holy shit. Oh, oh my god. fucking god! Not again! Get her out of there! Hey, professor? I don't care. She what is very I dead, know. sir. The professor. Grab the professor. Well, get her out of there! Why are the gentleman he's watching her? Bring her to the med ward immediately! Oh, fuck. Medics! Oh, my Medics, Doesn't grab man. the head! Grab the head of the professor, put it on the neck and right now. The head's gone! What do you mean, medics? <laughs> five fucking minutes! We're here for five fucking minutes! Motherfucker! What the fuck? I, I'm stunned! I don't know how the fuck! I don't know what the fuck to do. <sighs> I am not feeling good. Five fucking minutes. You got to be fucking kidding me. I'm, on. I'm fucking sorry. Uh, Are you okay? Five fucking minutes. Did it get you? I I, I don't know how to, I I don't know what the fuck to do. I don't know how to feel right now. Focus on breathing. <laughs> I need, I need. I wonder at least two students guarding this thing now. Let's do this simply for the time being. Yes, sir. No. No, I've been, I've been I've been just just had one uh, fucking shoes. job. If something breaks. I can go. Does he look okay? Everyone. fine. It's fine. Move, move away. It's fine. You, you too. I know I have no authority. Please Why check up on him. Make sure okay. They said we were supposed to go in here. Okay. All right. I, I honestly stunned. I am. I was not emotionally or physically or mentally prepared for this. I thought it was gonna be all cute and nice. We come back to the fucking. Oh my god. Oh, what did we do wrong? 
No matter what happens, we can't You're leave our hands. Eyes, Are you both okay? <laughs> I know. I know. Just I already know. Know. take it to the medical oh, right somebody now. somebody have a cloak or something to throw over there? Do you I'll think you can hold like this? Uh, it's a... It's just bitter hell. It's a... Yes, it fucking bit his head off! I got it first fucking in my face! Everyone, take it to the medical ward, whoever is capable of it. I'll be taking it. By the time I'm done with it, it's gonna be a damn good thing. That's it, the medical ward. Straight to the medical ward now. Good. Yes, sir. Of course. Yes. If you have not already, am I UK? We have one fucking job. Do not damage those things. I know, I know, I know. pops out again. Kill it. I know Zuku put his swords in its head to fry it. Fucking move from here. I didn't see it disappear, so I guess it's not dead. All right, Kaden. What exactly happened? Did, did, did the hinges come off? What exactly? What no, was the cage not stable it enough? I tried. This is yeah. yeah. where I was going to interrupt. We, ch we checked the cage. That is not a mover. That is a blaster. One that is acid based. Mover is its secondary property. Uh, this whole time Gil has been going around freezing it. Making it I was unaware this creature was in there. Checked the sort of fucking cage over, over and over again. Did you? Blaster. <laughs> Alright. You're it's still shouting. Here. What the fuck was that? It didn't, it didn't dissipate. Zuka put his sword through the head, but it didn't dissipate, so they think it's alive. If you're going to shout, <laughs> leave. <laughs> People are panicked enough already. Really. <laughs> think they'll be able to do anything. Is it wise to keep it on the open like this? Should we not lock and find as many doors as possible? Well, if we check standing here, it's somebody to preserve Alex's capabilities of doing that. It's very much doubt he can bring someone back. Can't fit the stairs down there, though. We'll have to do it some other way. Exactly. Well, there's one way that I've learned to form. If you can't move it, oh, they're up. knock I, it down. I got her, I got her, I got her, I got her. Okay, oh. I, I got her. It's fine, oh, I got her. Get in. I, I got her. Well, this might not work, but it's worth a shot. Nice. Yeah. She's, she's fine. I'm going to be honest she's, with you, all fine. of you. She's considering she's the events that just you're, happened, it's a Yeah, it's back in. Got rest of back in. Are you all right? Oh, well. We had one fucking job. Make sure the thing is we need to get her down somewhere. I don't. I don't. I, I, we need to get her somewhere. Let me know. Something you want to control? Of. So no, don't worry about it. I just rest peace. That's how they act. Pick her up fully. But otherwise. Okay, I, I got her. Alright, so you have the spell ready. Let me let me speak to Exaris. What happened? You'll be fine. Very good. Exaris, I'm gonna need your help. I've been taken to the med bay. Not for us to know right now. We're gonna be moving this down to the dungeon as as quickly as possible. Damn it. Oh, it's not gonna stay in that cage for long. We're losing the going to work a shorty professional, Exaris. We should watch the area. It, it was down. quick, it was clean, it was... Make sure it's yeah, sorry to yeah. say the details like that, but... At least it didn't, you know, take it too long. That means the recovery should be swift, if any. Well, if it's a spitter, it uses acid, doesn't it? I'll be holding the neck. Good. Why, why, right. how, why, how? Yes. Good. We need all the hands we can get. Maybe because it stopped moving, he put it down. It was resting. Also, because when we were transporting the box, it might have got a little agitated from the amount of rotation we were giving it on, on its voyage. I'm gonna go with Lothario. It's alive. That's good too. Let's, let's do that. I don't know. I think we're planning to kill it now after what just happened. I'm going to bring it to Mr. Mr. Tigers has said from what I've understood is that they're trying to subdue it and then move it into the uh, apparently in, uh, trying to make an enchanted area with <laughs> another way of the rose would keep That's actually upsetting, what the fuck? It does not seem to be that they are trying to kill it, but try to at least stay on, stay ready and on guard if anything should happen. Should we, should we take the box with us? I know I have no authority to give such commands, but this is the most enclosed area. You're relaying all the open it up outside somewhere else, we have no way of controlling it. You're not wrong. Alright. Get your chains ready. Get me as close as possible. Are they letting it back out? Right on its head. Oh yeah, we're letting it out. I'm going to train. I'm going to need to move back. Come on. Up. Uh, Professor, must in case worse, it goes to worse. 
<laughs> she doesn't have her weapons. And if we leave this room with her. area without destroying Got your enchantment just in case. Be sure if you've not enchanted your weapons and chat. Mother Fuck. <sighs> Even if it might be prepare for anything. Get your sword out. Good God. I'll reinforce you. What did he call it? I got the name wrong. The class? Spitter, I think. Yeah. Spitter primarily, move a secondary. Apparently, as they were saying, that the box is currently being sl starting to be dissolved by the acid. That's why we're uh, trying to subdue it and make sure that mouth is shut. Oh, gee. Give me I protect these tombs and I bless the grounds they walk Come on. and bless the soil they walk. I'm there, but I'm not. I got a stun arrow ready. Oh, blind. Yeah. Fucking What's chill it? session. Her, we should follow Morgan. Come on. Yeah. Amanda, that includes you. Come on. No, actually. Doesn't matter right now. Leave Your sword. Now. I feel like it's. Really you should get it. For at least from I from got from it! Professor Octavius, I think. If you're to follow. I know I don't have the commands to give such orders, I'm but being. at least it's my advice. Sir? Like, with such a beast, we should all be there to assist. Take a plan B. <sighs> just in case. It can't do shit. It really can't. But still, just in case. What are you going to uh, want to, of course, make sure everybody is said. I'm sorry you had to witness that. Are you alright, your students? This is a military academy. Yeah, that was something for your first day. One fucking job. One fucking job. <laughs> oh, this is making me so annoyed and sad. Ah! <laughs> It was. it was. What happened? It's acid burns to it restraints. Fuck. Fuck. That kills nothing. I'm not sure though. I have a feeling that they're not going to. Well done. Imagine <laughs> I could do one fucking thing right. I don't... I'm sorry. I lost my composure Captain. with you. Yes. What happened? Oh, this stings, motherfucker! I. I'm so mad. Oh, but it looks so good. <laughs> Oh, it looks so fucking good. Oh man. I think all go down there. No. Too many people in a close space will get in the way of each other. I mean, you did. Um, you did you check the cage. Shut up. Let's just get ready. Oh, <sighs> son of a bitch. Can't do it like this! Episode one! Motherfucker! What is happening? You were. I brought a diamond. We're just waiting. To the surprises. Very well. Mm. Then we shall stand Too up. Too many people You're down there will just make it more dangerous. We crowd up and get each in, in the way in case of an emergency. Very well. Smart choice. The best we could do is to be ready for when it. If it goes wrong. <sighs> oh. 
I have nothing changed. Miscellanea. Well, we're not doing anything. Perhaps I could read the rules to you. Hey, I do not think now was a good time. I'll fill them and keep an eye on Well, the I don't think we can well, help. I don't know yet. We should probably just start. From, uh, they were not present when Where it happened. So I assume so. Or oh, not. Oh, Excuse us. I completely yes. forgot by a chance. We're uh, going to walk through. Good. There you are. Gia, yeah, I would assume you are from Team Marco yeah. as well. Who was the uh, teacher? Uh, who was the team that Madame Skyet managed? Uh, Ventus? Yeah, yeah, she, she's... I don't remember. She managed... Uh, it was... Um, Ventus. Ventus. With a Bombadil. Ventus. They did it together. Oh god, no, they have more of it right now. I will... I mean... <laughs> I will meet up with this team, Ventus, after everything is done. I would like to give oh, my no, no, personal I, apologies as well. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything. I, 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 such things. I don't know anything about it. You can speak to Tao. Me and I just know there was some serious I bad blood between Ventus and this guy yet. It's good to meet you, Sinclair Dano. I'm one of the inv investors, but that does not matter right now. Should we maybe form up a little better so the spears are not in the back? I've seen I uh, behind the dagger? And I've the right here? Fair enough. So it's, no, no, it's no, I don't want to... I mean, I'm, I'm the one without fucking magic, so my shit ain't gonna work. I did not think we needed our weapons today! I did not add it to my model! Talks that need to be done within the team. If there's any sort of is the rest of Ignis that team members might do for my own psyche, take his muscle, keeping it down. Feel free to tell them to reach out to me. I'm Should I head down? You, speak with them. you cannot start fucking first. No, first. No, uh, beginning of season like this, you cannot do all right that, Dad. All right. Oh, we got Morgan. Morgan is it handled? Thank you for the offer. It's contained. Guy has mercy. I say stay out till we're told to put down. I do hope that guy uh, welcomes her within her circles after such an event. I'm gonna go play with this. I, I, I need. I need a moment. I... I don't fucking know. God, it... I did not know how the fuck to react. It would just... It, would, it happened from one second to the other. It just snap out of nowhere. Like, maybe... I'm not digging at you. Who'd you secure it with? Rivers. Okay. And you, you were positive. I checked the fucking thing every day, Jackson. Every fucking day. Okay. I trust you. I had one fucking job. For once I actually did something right. I had one job. And then this shit happens. I I need to not be here right now. I need I understand. Oh, this is rough. Couldn't it have been like mid season? Why they gotta bomb us like this? It's gonna be like first session, everybody's getting home, everybody's happy, we uh, have a party. It's all Gucci gang, Gucci gang. But nah. God damn. 
Oh, the fucking socks! But God, it looks so cool! Oh, but I hate it! I don't know where to put this! Oh no! Oh, there's so much happening right now! Ah! God, I, I sound so disgusting right now. I've got tears running everywhere. I, I don't know. I don't know where to put this. Oh no. <laughs> Is it like. I don't remember. Oh, yep. Yeah, yeah, that was. I'm just gonna <laughs> sit for a hot minute. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh shit. That's brutal. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh. One. Ah. Oh. God, I'm mad. I'm like, <laughs> I'm not actually mad, uh, but a little mad I am. In character, I'm super duper mad. I'm really fucking pissed. And I'm a little bit mad that they pulled this shit on us on first fucking session. <laughs> oh, they could not do us like this. Oh. Motherfucker. Oh, I did. Oh, where my water? Oh, I forgot my water too. <laughs> Damn it! Wait, didn't I? I don't know. Oh, what a shit show! Oh man. Oh fuck. That's not cool. I'm so fucking mad. I was so pissed. My god. I'm just gonna start on terror, I'm gonna start over. I'm gonna actually do good. <laughs> actually. Wait, my guy, what? Ah. Uh. God, I don't know how the fuck to feel. Cause I've ever felt like such a, a Oh, I don't even know. So it felt like you never did anything good on Ventus and now we're coming on territory like, oh I'm gonna do better, I gotta do something for this team, I gotta at least accomplish shit. And then this bullshit happens. Oh God it hurts. <laughs> My God. <laughs> mm. 
man, it just, it really just feels like my fault. We were checking the fucking box. And we didn't even, oh. Now fucking this guy, then he was so fucking nice to me. Ah. Ah. <laughs> God, I need. Oh. God, I need. Hey, Emma, do you mind if I come sit with you? <sighs> you okay? Oh, you know, it's everything fucking peachy. We riff beast that we can't kill the professor. It's all fucking great, Kingsley. No, it's not. Well, I just found out about this, so... Okay. We didn't know it was gonna happen. Okay? We had one fucking job. I checked that box and every fucking it. day. I, ch I should have known. I should have known that they couldn't say that box and I didn't and... Fuck! Emma. It's okay. You may not think it's okay right now. However, if you kept checking the box, you did your job. You were well, doing your job. Apparently not. You were probably better than a lot of other people doing it right now. I don't think anyone else would have bothered. No, that was my job. That was my only job. You did. I just had to check the box every day, make sure it stayed in the box, make sure the box were cleared. And it was. For once, I did actually do my job. For once, I did good. And then this bullshit and happened. you did? I didn't! If I you did... You did, because if, if you did, it, if you didn't do your job, it would be unleashed on the ship. You guys would have been dead. You did your job. I'm pretty sure it was what uh, transferring it over to to the arena. I think something may have caught it or something. What the cage or something? I don't think this isn't your fault. Once I just felt like I was doing something right, and now I've got a teacher you doing something right though. Fucking teacher. None of us were prepared for this. Alright then. Okay? And, if anything, knowing Skya, I don't think she would want us to be... ...blaming ourselves. For something that was... ...probably inevitable. I, I will admit, I do not think a metal cage could withhold it for such a long time. But then I should have found out. Should have found out sooner that the case wasn't meant to hold. And how are you, I'm sorry Emma, how are you meant to know that? Because I was checking it every day. Surely I, w no, I want to see something. No, 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 not that. No, not that. Oh, we don't know anything about Rift Beasts apart, you know, from what we know. We don't know, like, if they can... We can clearly see they can go through metal. It's not your fault for what happened, okay? No one's fault. I just don't want to be a fucking failure for once. Just one. And you're not. You're not a failure. I don't think people here on the campus, I don't think anyone would say that. Teachers might say that, but they're just trying to give you tough love. 
and all that. I'm gonna make sure that you actually boost yourself up and morale and shit. But I don't think you're useless, I don't think you're a failure in anything. We now know for next time, though, of what happened. We can make sure that this doesn't happen again. We can prevent it. I'm sure a lot of you are feeling like um, we're responsible for this. None of you are. It happens. God, fucking sucks. What the fuck do I do now? Clearly fucked up in Mendes and now I've fucked up real bad in Terra. It will not actually cut out for this. Probably have stayed at home. And not make trouble. Cause that's what I always do. Good old Emma always getting into trouble. Always making disaster wherever she goes. Apparently Jackson told me that Jackson told me apparently he shouted at you in front of everyone. Yeah, I don't blame him. I don't think he meant it at all. Oh, People do dumb things in emotional moments. They don't think before. Then, but at least emotional. It doesn't matter. Really. It does matter. Because I know he doesn't mean it anyway. 
I know you're not a failure. Look, think about what happened a few weeks back, well, months back, really. I went to Camvale. Is it Camvale? The word. I don't remember. Was it Camvale? Shit, I don't Multiple people could have died. But they didn't. Because you helped. God, my brain is just going thousand miles right now. I don't know what the fuck to do. Could um, you want to get into somewhere a little bit warmer? It is pretty cold out here. No, it's fine. I just I just want to sit here and cool down a little bit. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I'm not really. I just want to make sure. It's fine. I I appreciate it. For what it is. <laughs> I'm good at hugs. Sure. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> if anything, if you're in any trouble or you just need someone to talk to. I'm always here to lend an ear, okay? Oh, Big You're not Daddy. alone. Big Daddy figure, <laughs> Kingsley. Okay. Thanks, man. Oh, where's that smile? <laughs> I really feel like smiling right now, if I'm being honest. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I, I understand. Ah, I need some tissue. I'll probably go check on all your teammates as well. Make sure they're okay. Honestly, I can't even face them right now. And you don't have to. The way I, well, in all fairness, sometimes you just need some space away from your own teammates. It's yeah. what I do with mine. I don't. Stay around them often. <sighs> Mainly because mm. I don't feel like I need to. I feel bad. Being all the way back in vintage. Because I just can't trust them. Not right now, at least. Some of them. That's fair. Two zone. <laughs> Alright then. We'll figure something out. We'll get through this together, okay? Yeah. Now I'm gonna sit with you here until you're okay. Well, <laughs> until you want to get up and all that. Oh, I'll bring that will be I'll okay! We don't have to though. I just <sighs> need to figure out what my next move is. What I gotta do for him here, you know? Got a question? You regret coming here? Well, after seeing that shit show. Maybe just a little bit, yeah. I can't hear you. What? I'm not talking? Saying anything? Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Uh oh. 
Oh no. I wait here. <laughs> I need to be. Re- re- don't worry. <laughs> I need to hold out. Yep, it's fine. I wait here for it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! That sucks! Oh shit! Like, give me an excuse to get tissue paper because fuck me! <laughs> oh man, God! Oh. Oh, this is like fucking second time I had a cry session and people couldn't fucking hear me. Which is probably for the best. <laughs> but still sucks. Hey, got my dialogue through. Ugh. Mother trucker. Ugh. God, it fucking sucks. Oh god, there was so much sound. Oh. Ah, ah. Mike, Mike. Yes, Mike. Oh god. Do, do. Uh, I did not put an invincible trooper. There we go. <laughs> I don't know why we it. Hey, come on. <laughs> God, this sucks. <laughs> it's like. Uh, oh, fuck. Uh, the storm said. Arena. Do, 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 do. Giggly, my man. Hey, hey. Excuse me and my lack of speech. <laughs> Just chilling. God damn. Okay, oh, uh, fuck. Yes, terror. There, I have something stuck in my throat. No. Excuse me. It's not good, don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, uh, after seeing that shit show, I kind of regret coming here. Not gonna lie. Yeah. I mean, I kind of regret coming here, but that's mainly because, you know, yeah. I'm losing an arm now, so. Yeah. I am. Um, I, can, I, can, I can see that, yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, I regret. Uh, mainly, I regret being here because. Well, one the arm and two everybody that I spent time with is gone. So yeah, but in the end, that's just the world, isn't it? Oh, I ah announcements. Great, <sighs> fun, fun, fun. You ready to face the music? At least <sighs> for what we've got. I guess ain't gonna be sweet music to the ears. That's for sure. Don't worry. Yeah. It's all good though. Oh. I just realized like <laughs> Oh god those was... more people had come around. Oh. So what was that not that was like announcement bell, was it? I guess not. Since people are not walking away. I don't know. I guess maybe people were returning from, I don't know. Oh God, the lag! Hello. I need to like carefully check my mic once in a while to make sure it doesn't go burr. Seems it's captain's meetings. Uh, so see. wherever you're meeting your team's probably gonna have to go talk. What? Someone's not going. 
Yeah, well, the Penny and Solus are going to talk, I guess. Oh, uh, I guess. Very... So, yep, they went to talk. Students, I am unsure. Did anyone else hear the bell? Yes. Yes, we did. Do you Freaking loud. know where we're supposed to gather? This is my first day here. Uh, I believe that was the captain and uh, the captain's meeting. It's where the, uh, the captains of every team and the uh, second in commands go talk to the chancellor. Mm -hmm. And uh, we meet yeah, in our so. respective places. I do believe, though, professors what? are meant to be there, surely. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh right! He's scared of birds! I forgot! That would be the Oh no! Oh no, oh, I forgot! Yeah. I'll be back, Tal. Right. <sighs> Just imagine he's more robot than bird. He'll be fine. It would be easier if it was the head. Is it like the beak? I already know hard. what mechanized people can do. Have you seen Val? Just imagine a bird with that. Power. That, that, that is true. I mean, have you seen his? Well, well no. Mm -hmm. you, you Remember, he told me he has a weak heart. A what? He has a what? He has a weak heart, so he's dependable on either tech to huh. be alive. Oh. That's the device um, on his chest. So the, the, the I mean, they're, they're weak and that's, that's okay. Yes, good, good. I mean, not good for them that they're like that, but I, I mean... Mm, I'm pretty yes. sure he cannot fly. That's a, a thing of matter to you. Yes. Good. That That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Not that it really matters, you know. I, I, I'm sure there's nothing wrong with the uh, primal Zirica. Um, yes. I mean, on the positive <clears throat> side, there's not other birds around. It's pretty much just him. Since all the other birds yes. have flown, flown up to hotter areas, so... They, they, they don't like the winter now. That's It's good. Good. Less birds, just one big mechanized nocturnal bird. <clears throat> yeah. Not too kind of a uh, bird? No, no, not, not, no, no, but birds are, uh, birds are birds. That's, that, that's, that, uh, yes. He's mm. absolutely terrified. Okay. I'd, uh, noticed that. Good thing, uh, maybe you will not be your professor then, if you are not interested in either thing. Yeah. No, 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 just, uh, not me, no. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll not be touching that, especially not, I, I mean, nothing. There's nothing wrong with the, with the, with the Zurica, yes, I, I mean, it's fine. I'm so, I'm sure they're great at, at that, you know, with the leg and the heart and, mm. it, it is okay, <laughs> it, I'm afraid. It is okay. I, I gotta get over it, you know, and Rift Beast, all of this, and then there's that bird, and, you know, I'm sure somewhere there's just a big bird, Rift Beast, waiting to come swoop down, and, oh, I really wish I didn't think of that. Um. Huh. No time to be scared. Yes. No, but small things is okay to be scared of. Um. Hmm. Sorry to interrupt, but um, we're meeting in the main hall, and I'll just do your team the favor. Wait, you're already a captain, aren't you? Aren't you supposed no, to be with your other I, I, I was for a time, but it's it's complicated. It's Val. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, have you seen my other two members running around here? Or no? I'm afraid not. Well, no. Is everybody meeting in the hall, not just the captains? All right. Um, every, now everyone's to meet in the great hall. In in the main hall. All right. right. Everyone oh, else has to go. Off then. We're good to go. <sighs> Actually, Varys. Are you alright? No, I'm not. And uh, yes. 
I think Solus and Penny are still in there talking. Can you maybe get them? Yes. Thank you. I want to look as little amount of terror people as humanly possible or rapidly pos possible p possible god damn i'm like I, I cannot i feel so shit i feel absolutely completely sh and i don't remember which rock does the thing oh no i'm gonna walk <laughs> i don't remember yeah <clears throat> Yay. <sighs> Mine god. God, this. I could pr probably gonna fucking repeat myself like a 20 million times right now, but fuck, it sucks. I'm like, internally in my stomach, I can feel that how much it sucks. Well, god damn, what, what's, what's elusive gonna do now? Gonna. Oh god, now I'm just having scared photos of her having like fucking giraffe Ava Tech neck. <laughs> oh no! I don't need that in my life. <laughs> Ava Tech Sky yet it's not real. <laughs> it's just it's, it's just a nightmare. It's not real. Fucking sucks, fucking sucks, fucking sucks. No, 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 no. Oh, somebody said. Well, I thought I was gonna be happy, drunk, uh, party, Emma, but nah. Are you sure you're okay? I really don't want to answer that right now. It's good to see you. You too. <sighs> Captain. Captain. I'll just finish up and I'll help him out there to her. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. If you happen to see Gallup before you arrive, uh, yeah. should we? No, I have to press them. No. Not since he was looking for Oriana earlier. Mm. Mm. Shozuka's out to look for him, so you best to just wait. Yeah. I'm gonna make sure Kel didn't go back to the library. I let him know when he uh, ramp up. No, I think he's. He uh, did. Uh, he's having oh, some he's problems with his head. Understood. You did your job, Emma. Yeah. Didn't do it good enough. Are all the professors um, still in the meeting? I'm unsure. Shouldn't have exploded on you back there. It doesn't matter. He wasn't at the dorm. Inappropriate. You did your job. You didn't do anything wrong. Could have done better. I can try other places. Doing at the moment. Uh, it would be best to wait. I believe Taki has tried to run the Should have done better. I could have had a shit eye. Just for the record. Did your best. I'm not sure exactly if that can communicate with well, you. not good enough. They can run me back if need be. They weren't like that when we were taking it. Hey. Did you find Angie by oh, chance? On the, I'm sure you'll find out. No, on the I didn't. They weren't mm. melted, they were tampered with. Well, it looks like we have a little time, so I'll just check the training ground again. Yeah, I'm good. Be back. Thanks for putting this information. Making sure everyone else is okay. When has keeping secrets from some of the people here ever been productive? 
It's understandable, however. They killed it? Yeah. Who? They figured it was true. You sure you don't want like a bad the professor? Is, uh, what? They what? They no, because they figured it was okay, too much so of a liability so to keep. What do you think? Zeku, calm whole down. Point. Calm down. There's no point in yelling at each She's other, please. She's dead now. Why would you kill it? <sighs> Stand the burial, it couldn't be kept. Fuck it out. Okay, well, thanks for letting okay. us know. Next time we won't do it. Wait, what? Fuck, what the fuck? Why? Wait, who did? I don't know. I guess it's Aaron this morning. They killed the Zangy before they built it here in the first place. Now someone died. And they died oh, look, another <laughs> decision made for us. Because there wasn't a way. Mm. That's wrong, you wanna, you might wanna sit down, so, put it on the TV. Yeah. It wasn't. It's clear that whatever happened one time, it's clear that that's worth. Killing is the right call. Whoever did it, I'm scared to make it. Ah. Yeah, baby. I wish I was gonna do it. It's the price we paid to learn from that mistake. No, there's no need to walk too far. Keeping it alive lets us make the same one. Ah. Jackson, I... Oh, if I might ask, how are the students taking it? I understand it's a difficult thing, but I would still like to inquire as well. The cage might have been faulty. Nailed it. It's difficult. Who provided the cage? <sighs> Don't know. That's just what they were. They, they believe to be. Yes. Shame in him. I've already said my condolences to the teachers, but I'd like to at least say to the okay, nope, students nope, as well that give us condolences why for your loss. That's why I say fuck it. Nope, nope, nope. Mm. Motherfucker. I'm, I'm not gonna sit here and listen to them talk shit about my cage. I fucking tried to fix that cage. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not dealing with that. I'm not. <sighs> Emma. Emma, please stop. We gotta go back in there. I'm, I'm, I can't. They're literally talking about the cage. I know what I did with the cage. I. You didn't do. I just can't. We I... all did what we could. I just can't. I can't. Wait, look, right if, now. if, if. I know. I'm sorry. I know. And it's just. I doubt it. I doubt they're going to reprimand you, especially in front of everyone. I think I did enough there. They just want us to listen to the next thing. That's it. And then I will let you go for the rest of the day, okay? That's it. Please. Five. Yeah. I let him know that you were positive. The whole team was. It counts. God, now I just wish that someone else had taken that cage. God, it hits harder than it should. Right. Motherfucking Calm cage. Down. Stupid fucking cage. We will be burying the body. God, it, oh, it hit so stupidly in my gut. 
to share stories, please feel free to come and share those stories, whether positive or negative. Whether you thought she was your greatest friend, a stalwart guy, or you thought her a huge bitch. She Ooh. could be all these things. There is no reason to sugarcoat her life. So please come, tell your stories, and let us say goodbye to her together. Send her off to Voy. And understand that she paid the price so that we may continue moving forwards. And we will move forwards from this. Now. As many of you are <laughs> undoubtedly aware, oh, I'm paper. Our sponsor, Miss Elia Rosewood herself, has arrived on the island. Whoop, whoop. We also have with us a member of the Setting Sun, as well as a new professor. <sighs> professor, if you may. You may introduce yourself and what you will be doing here. Oh no, he needs to shout. Oh yeah, I'm not, I'm not, oh shit. Okay, I'm not the only one who can't hear. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Thank you, Professor. And now, something that I know a few squads are interested in. We have new unsorted members. Both new and old. Unsorted. You could join me on stage. <clears throat> These men and women have decided to risk their lives just as you have. These are future soldiers and they will be joining your ranks in the coming days. You have to show them the ropes Is that understood? Yes, sir. 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 Mm -hmm. We will be doing the sorting sometime early next week. Now, in the coming days, I want everybody to stay inside the barrier. There is a snowstorm brewing and we are to stay inside. Beyond this, I'm sure many of you are curious about the rift piece itself, as our containment procedures did not pan out. Myself and the other professors have put it down. It is no longer a threat as of this moment, and we are currently looking into how it escaped. Look no further. I'm not saying quiet about this. The damn lock was tampered with. 
We saw it ourselves. It wasn't the acid that broke it. Yeah. What? I am aware of this. And you will not speak out of turn, Gil. God, what, what, what more are you Where keeping you from us then if you already knew? Yeah. Always, I never learned any secrets. This. You said we are soldiers now, aren't we? Gil, you continue to talk out of turn. If you would let me continue speaking, please. Captain, if you can con cannot control your soldiers, perhaps you do not deserve to remain captain. <gasps> no. As I was saying before, I was interrupted. Since Miss Elaine is here, we will be looking into exactly how this failed. We will get to the bottom of this. Whether the Rift Beast itself has some kind of strange shaker ability that was able to occultically dissolve the lock, or whether there was further tampering happening, we will figure out what happened. However, I will not be having students pointing fingers, coming up with wild accusations. I will not have my soldiers causing chaos. This will be dealt with calmly. Is that understood? Yes, sir. 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 Good. Kiki. Sir, do we have any further plans to end the people with details and try to bring the rift beast to shadows again? That is currently to be seen. course now this is the part where people may speak up and ask questions how did it break containment on the dungeon as far as it did not break containment in the dungeon it was being held in place with a ritual from our professor Octavian However, it could not be kept up in long term. And as previous containment procedures proved to be a failure, it was decided that instead of burning lots of mana to keep it contained, that it would simply be destroyed. Was this the original plan? Was there any plan in place for long term containment? Yes, the crate. It was heavily armored, it was alchemically treated to resist acid, it should have held. Boom! Should have. Yes. <laughs> Ventus, you had your hand up. And as a reminder, oh, he, he's talking. I was just kidding. <laughs> of course. Yes. Anybody is able to come to the funeral to help with the burial. Especially those who happen to be close to Miss Kayet. It will be happening at sundown. I need to see her before she gets buried. At the graveyard. It will help with divination. If that is everything, then you are dismissed for your days. 
And if it hasn't been mentioned, the arena is under quarantine. Under no circumstances are you to enter it, is that clear? Yes, sir. Fuck! Yes, sir. Good. Even That's bullshit. Of her hair. Ah! Oh god, everything's upside down. You'll find out soon enough. It's clear. We need to do investigations. If I find anyone in there, you'll be personally punished by me. Yeah, 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 yeah got it. Listen, I'm... Detective Emma needs to be on the hunt. Someone tampered with my box. No one come in here and tamper with my box. No one see me. I'm not. I'm not going in. I swear. I need to be there, over there and think. I, I won't go in. Don't fuck with my luck. Detective Emma? Not on the case. But Detective Emma? Be thinking. So, what do we do? We... We check the box. Take the box every day. We check the chains. Because we did not want that motherfucker to run around on the ship and get us all killed. Checked it every day. Then... Penny. If you want to help, then help from outside. I just want to get your ass beaten. I can take whatever Octavian dishes out. I was already in there anyway. It wasn't acid that melted that lock, it was something else. It's already been confirmed it's been tampered with. I know, I'm the one who saw it. It's not, it wasn't acid, it wasn't... The whole thing about, you know... It might, if a wrist beast has an ability to do, to shake the lock or damage it or ruin it in some way, I don't think that holds up. Did this look, look melted at all? In some way? No. Whereas if it would have been melted, we would have noticed. Broken. If it happened after, I wasn't present, so I'm asking questions because I don't know, Emma. We check that damn fox every day. Yeah. But I if it got loose, Solis. it was after it... the boat, not when we were on the boat. Or maybe it was when you were docked. Maybe those pirates or that other guy from that other school wants to ruin our reputation or something. I know he said don't start wild theories, but would you really hold it that little to the rich to do something like that? Try to ruin us for their gain? I've seen it before. Oh no. We are supposed to be here to um, scout people and see if any of us are uh, a valid member for their um, institution, if we agree. If this happens and we are suspecting of them, then that doesn't speak well for them either. Well, on the other hand, maybe they tamper with our stuff and, makes, and ask, you know, hey, who's not happy with the Rosewood Institution and get those people on board? I do believe most of the people here are not stupid to just fall for that if out of the blue they start asking you are not happy here because of what happened? Why don't you come with us? And that will be like rather obvious that maybe they had some hand in it.
I don't doubt that we're, you know, we're smarter than than that to see through that lie, but maybe he's not. Or again, maybe we're both wrong and it's the pirates. Or why would the pirates trade like what would they have to gain? I don't know. There's a lot of money here. While we're dealing with this mess, they can go take something. It's called a diversion. What if I don't know them, so I cannot say for sure. Again, Sorry? why will they have to gain? The new students. I didn't like how Vesper... What will they win by doing that? I don't know, but Vesper was way too comfortable with that box. That is true. I'll give you that. I haven't met any of these new students yet, so I'm not sure. A very religious guy. Maybe Gaia Almighty stuff and stuff. He is not a um, worshipper of Gaia, so I'm not sure who he worships. I don't know you, Luke. But uh, he seems rather... Um, annoyed with everyone that uh, prefers either tech and uh, doesn't speak so well of the gods. Yeah, very religious. Any gods. Maybe he friended with the logs to let it go. Maybe he believes that they're all creatures should be free or some bullshit like that. I don't fucking know. We just need something solid to go off of. We can figure out what broke the lock or what was tamper what tampered with the lock. We can probably match something to it and then we'll have at least a better idea of what we're going at. Or if who might have done it? I don't care if all of us have to be searched. Somebody probably has tools on them. Man, I, I do not like this. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Can we check the thing? Then there was a couple people up there. I just want to get a better look at that lock. Trust me, you're not the only one. I do. Wait. Mm. Does anyone know what the lock is? Because if not, they will be maybe. Yeah, what's about the safe inside the arena? Yeah, it's in there with the box. Yeah. And some teachers I... just went in there. I. I did go to, well, but you asked me to go and check. There was no one there, but, uh, well, there was something in the middle of Professor Bomba they walk in from this angle, and since there was no one, I just went outside. What's he looking for? Keep your eyes on him. I'm gonna go in and see if I can assist. If Octavian stabs me, he stabs me. Then you should got told that uh, it's off limits and they were gonna be personally punished if someone walks in the arena. Yeah, that's what he says. He, he won't care. Not my first time getting personally punished. Alright. <sighs> well, there's a teacher in there, so he won't get far. <laughs> As the Takuya guy, our teacher. Mm. But if he can just have a small peek. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is not empty and there are more people in. Yep. Do you want to go in? I want to have a small peek. Because I swear to God, I looked at that box every fucking day, Varys. Every fucking day. If someone fucking we all did, with that but shit, it's probably. If he did, it was when we were and uh, looking around, and it was probably once we talk. Or uh, did they manage to take the crate off the of the ship? Maybe. Or did it happen just as we talk? Maybe. Or when people were asleep. I mean, hmm. I wasn't asleep, but I was still inside, so people could definitely have been outside. Best way to. Um... 
if you do want to take a peek, probably the best entrance is the side ones. There are a lot of people over there, and the front one is uh, obvious kid, uh, giveaway, and uh, he hasn't come back, so... No, and Octavius just walked in there, so he's probably getting his ass beaten right yes. now. Unless he's good at hiding. So if you want to... If you want to take a peek, maybe, from the uh, entrance on the back? Wait, there's an entrance over there. That there's an entrance over there. Well, I I never went over there, but there's a door inside that just points that direction. So, huh. I guessed. I never seen that. Yeah, because there's too many people over there. there I think it's probably in there with Penny getting there. There are three doors. Shit! I, how did I never notice? Ah oh, well, I'm unsure if there's a door over that direction, but there's a door inside in that direction. Yeah. Also be so maybe it's just a uh, hallway inside. I mean, it was hollow on the but, inside. But uh, there is a... Might be. But there, there, there is double door, so we can try to uh, get in, get in the hallway and just have a tiny peek without technically going inside the arena. I mean, as long as we don't go inside. There's some rocks over there. You can take out up on, on the wall. And then the wall can take us all the way up there then we can see from down there are you suggesting to climb up the walls no there's some rocks over there they're easy to get up against right wait sure at this point i just want to i want some goddamn answers no a bit more about everything because I find out who the fuck messed with my fucking box. They're fucking dead. I'm pretty sure the more than one pe person will want them dead. So, because at this point it's personal. We had a look at our box every day, you and I. Every day. Everything was in check, so that's uh, what I was puzzled when I heard that the the ref cussed out. Exactly. Right. Now the ruins uh, either in that direction or probably inside, so... I will say to either go over there and see if anyone's trying to get inside the arena, or we can go on the other side and check what is over there. We can just get a quick peek to see if anyone can see us. And maybe... I'm gonna hide my ears. I'm not good at hiding with my ears out. That is true. I... Yeah, maybe... It... Yeah, maybe it just goes inside the walls then. Hmm. Okay, no, maybe. There is just an inside wall door, maybe? Maybe. But, uh... Um, they're not, like, really close trees to the wall, except for that one, but, uh... That's why we're still the rocks. far away. We take the rocks, Varys. Come. You can jump, right? I, of course I can jump, but I, I, I have legs. Yeah, but can you jump? Jump. I'm pretty sure I can jump, jump. Good. Because we'll need Not it. Not so sure how far, but I can jump, jump. Good, because we'll need it. Because I'm pretty sure that it's a small I gap. Mean, if necessary. If necessary, I can just make a bridge. I mean, I guess. Should be around here. Yeah, still here. Um, right, this is just here. Yeah. yeah, but at least it'll take us over there and then we can have a peek inside. Oh, um. <laughs> oh there you go. 
for a second I thought I was not good to jump. I was gonna be very sad if that was the case. Now you got it. It's, it's normally not that bad of a jump, but sometimes you just gotta really use your knees. See shit from Do you see anything? Because I don't see shit. Nope, me neither. Yep. Damn it. This, this, um, oh, oh no, I just said like, just see fog. That thing. Dang it. I hope we will at least see something from here. At least well, see if, um, if someone was in there. How the um, daredevil do you feel? What are you suggesting? I like your star bears. There are some roof on San Diego. I think I've grown tired of not uh, doing the correct things as I used to. Honestly, can you even see the box in there? I cannot see shit, but the uh, other option we have is going around see if we have a better view, because if I remember correctly, the box was closer to the entrance. Yeah, because I'm about to say, as good an idea it is to jump in there, if the box is not even there, then what's the point? That is true. Shit, I don't see it. No, they probably moved it. Fuck. Yeah, it's supposed to be like right, right there. That's um. It was right there the last time I checked where it was like, oh, Bombardier got in, so maybe he moved it? But shit. All right. Well, I guess Penny's we getting tried. his ass, if we tried, and I guess Penny's getting his ass beat for nothing, because nothing's in there. Let's get out here. At least before someone noticed. Even though we didn't technically not break any rules. Technically, we'd never got in the arena, so... Yeah, told enough not to get in. We did not. And if Octavius want to beat our ass, then so be it. Oh god, first thing I thought there was people down there, it was just like poles. It's really fucking foggy. I, I, as soon as you said, oh, I turned around and I thought exactly this. Yeah, it looked like two people was just talking down there, but... God, it's really fucky. <laughs> Again, wait for spring to come by. I do prefer spring too. Yeah. <sighs> oh well. <sighs> All right. All right. Uh, maybe if we go to the, the training ground next to the arena, there were like people gathering for some rest. Probably. Surely someone would have seen anything if they actually carried it out. Or maybe we can find Penny. Run through that tree. What? You just run through a tree, like that, the one that is right there. Where, what? Where is there no tree? It's... Maybe I'm just, uh, I haven't had a good sleep because we were on the boat. Yeah. And I just need some rest. Yeah, it's, yeah. It, it's been a long trip.
Have you noticed that the, the, next to the arena, the place is just always uh, oddly quiet? There are not even birds around. I mean, it is winter, so it's fair that there's no birds around, but yeah, I didn't no. notice around fall. Before we left, at least. Yeah, it was pretty quiet. So I think the birds just prefer to be outside the barrier. That's my guess. Watch out for the tree! Oh. Wait, wait, there's no tree. Don't worry. See, there's no tree. It's it's just nothing. There's nothing here. There's a tree there, and a tree there. Um... Don't worry about it. I'll uh, deal with the um, um, things. Just seeing the weird things. I thought it was maybe the bad eyesight since I had a game my side, but uh, maybe I just seen doubles or something like that. Yeah, maybe because there's a tree there and there. Like, uh, yeah, maybe you just need to get used to your vision still. Well, Penny's out and he's still walking, so he's not dead. In the same place, show up eventually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were just training. Everyone seems here, so I really thought people were gathering for something mm. for the arena, but maybe they're just training or no well, just training or chatting. And so far, people's just training, mm. Captain. Do you mind if I join you? No, go ahead. Oh, no problem. Are we considering another new students? All the spots are filled, I think. I don't think we have a, a spot at the moment. Wait, that's why we have our uh, lovely right. new teammate right here. Wait, I, I apologize. No problem. <clears throat> as far as advice for the others, I'm not really <coughs> <coughs> sure it's our place to input. Ah. You guys, um, I mean, it goes without saying, but you, you are all clear for resting today. They take the venue um, and get time If that wasn't resting. said enough by the professors, it's coming from me, so. Whatever you need to do. What I gotta do is think. Don't personally feel like resting. Mm -mm. Gotta think. Think, 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 think. Could they moved it inside the castle. Unless someone saw it uh, over here, it uh, will be quite impressive that they managed to move it without anybody seeing it. 
unless they decided to move it at the exact same time we uh, were going to the site, which will have been an uh, interesting timing. Yeah. Could they have moved them into the castle? Well, have they moved it if they like moved it into the castle? I know. Maybe Bombardels won't want to look at it. Maybe up in Aphotech. I oh, know. Do you have access to the um, Aethertech uh, facilities? It's fairly easy. They don't know how to use stores, Varys. Come. Oh. Um, Alright. That's a faulty thing. They're very smart, but they don't know how to use doors. And surely, if we can get our hands on Bombadil, surely he'll spe spill some beans. It does seem like the kind that he will not tell them. Kept a lot of secrets. No, for such a big mustache, he uh, not good with secrets. Evil Godless Ferris. Oh, God, the lag. <laughs> I do not remember which door goes where. I don't think so. <sighs> I doubt they will put it uh, right in the middle of where everybody can see it, having in mind that everyone is questioning everything at the moment. Yeah. It's most likely in one of the professor's offices, maybe? Probably. Uh, most likely Professor Bombardil if he's the one that took it or... Uh... Yeah. Oh, I was looking for this. It's a bolt. Alright, it's uh, your workplace, not mine. Yeah, been fiddling with my, with my gun lately. Well, let's try Bombardils, I guess. Excuse me. I'll need to do something about this gun. Cannon. The cannon in the middle of the room? Yeah. yeah. Vel's idea. I'm, I'm not sure where, where, where he went with it. As long as it's not loaded in the middle of the place, I think it's alright. I mean, hopefully it's not loaded. But, uh, I'd like. I mean, we haven't really have a Apotech professor in a hot minute, so he could technically go in there and load it whenever he felt like it, but I, I don't... That is true. Oh god, I'm yawning! <sighs> I'm starting to think that maybe the professors and... Um... Professor Bombardil too, where 
inside the arena but uh, maybe the fog uh, that was around was not was a bit too thick for us to see maybe if we get our hands on penny he could probably tell us that is true we should have asked penny he was standing right in front of us yeah very much so don't like it don't like it one bit this is pretty nice. I don't. I'm not sure how to feel about the um, um other guy. I always forget the name. Yeah, yeah. But oh, uh, the seems pretty nice. Mm. Cordial enough, at least. Maybe we can um, ask him for some things in his he's our closer professor. Maybe he can give us some I don't think information to calm our minds. Well, he can say if the cage is still on the other arena or uh, somewhere else. That is just stating a fact. Professor? Oh, yes. Sorry. Was it you needed? We were um, a bit uh, concerned about the whole situation. We were wondering if uh, the, the arena is closed because the cage is inside, or uh, is it possible for us to steal the cage somewhere? The arena for the current moment is quarantined specifically because we don't want anybody else tampering more than who should be there, which is faculty at the moment. I know that right. you may have some concerns over the matter, but it is to make sure that more, no more than a certain set of hands should be dealing with the cage at this moment. Will it be possible to, under your supervision, to look at the cage once uh... The professor Sarton. Right now, I'm going to say until I get confirmation from Malik, no. Again, the simple matter is that, un unlike yourselves, I mean, like yourselves, others are also interested in looking into the case, and everybody wants to solve it as quick as possible. But the more hands get involved, the more things get complicated and get sloppy. We are working on this right. as much as we can right now. And we are investigating every possible angle and every possible person. We may think may be delinquent in the matter. I'm as furious as anybody when it comes to the death. And I will make sure whoever did that, if it is tampering, comes to justice. All right. Thank you very much. Nice. If we can be of any help, uh, please let us know. Well, you're specifically my squad. I might need your assistance in the future. Keep your ear to the ground. And... Noted. Sorry, I couldn't be more of an ease to your burden. It's alright, we understand. Uh, if he's Jesus. That's my team terror. It's as spectacular as you are. Uh -huh. I know you're probably concerned, and seeing as you've just come on to terror, it's probably. Not the best of openings, but I'll take care of you all, and I'll look over you. If you find anything, let me know, and we'll investigate it together. Right? And I just need to know what happened to that box, because I check that box every day. This is personal. 
It's been tampered with, it looks like. Exactly. Therefore, I'm taking this way personal. So what will you do when you find the culprit? Hmm? I'm fought so far, yeah. Tell me. What's, what's your plan from there? Right now, I just need to figure out what exactly happened to Skyad. What happened to the box? Right, and I'm investigating that. I've already looked into some affairs where people have been pointing fingers. It's all over the place. But let's say you do find the culprit before we do. What will you do? Definitely deserve a good ass beating, sir. Aye. But you don't know what tricks they have up their sleeve, what allies they may have in hold, what might be the greater plan. Before you make a move, you consult with me. Yes, sir. Do you swear it? Yes, I swear. I will give you one chance, Emma. Please, do not break my trust. I'm a kind man. But I also want of tact. If you can't be trusted on this matter, then it will be difficult going forward. Understand? Already made too many mistakes, sir. I'm not gonna make another one. Good. Then we have an agreement. Do what you can and explore around. But for now, until I can get confirmation, stay away from the arena. Yes, sir. There may be actually something that you may be able to do. I was already in. Yeah, you. you right. Were. I did not know. I thought I was in <laughs> regular. <Anyway. laughs> I don't exactly trust a new friend, per se. Which one? He has been uh, Mr. Ambassador when the sea's over. You're not the only one. He's been too ex He's been too chummy, he's been asking a lot of questions, and he specifically knew about the lock having no experience henceforth. I'm very suspicious of him. Shit. And where his stance is. Being as he is for the school, he thinks people will not persist. I have no such venture to hold him to such a high level now. If you see him, try to tail him, but stay at a safe distance. If you can, probe him about questions, about his history, his past, anything you can do to keep conversation. Yes, sir. If it's a felt, uh, he was a rather interesting in uh, me and my situation. Apparently, he's the follower of Guy and he wanted to talk with me at some point. We can use that to our advantage. Right. But get him talking, loosen his lips, and anything you can find. But make sure you stay at safe distance. If you feel any foul play at work, Make sure you provide and take care of yourselves. You are my first priority. Traitors will get what they deserve. But you are my first and foremost. You are the future of Rosewood and the rest of this nation. Keep yourselves your highest priority. Little investigators. Detective M! You're making me proud. <laughs> what a tear to his eye! <laughs> Off you go. Come. And remember what I said. Pass it on to Jackson and the others as well. Got it. Right. Oh, will we? Bum, bum, oh, we just got some um, formation to. Give us something to work with, yeah. Yep.
And we have an advantage. You. That is true. Uh, you mean for uh, the interest of that um, individual, right? Mm. I mean, we're gonna gonna... God damn it! Um. What I'm trying to say is that we're not gonna leave you alone with him, that's for sure. But you're definitely an advantage. You're very interested I appreciate that. Yeah, no, I'm not doing that. If anything, I'll probably step a few st step back. That's probably about uh, what I can do. You can probably... You can probably stay around, like, on a uh, yeah, distance, just in case. Yeah. And, uh... We'll see how it goes. Mm. Detective Emma. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Detective Ferris. Ba -ba -ba -ba. He, he, he's just following. Um. Right. All right. Let's go find that bastard. It'll probably be where a lot of students are. So I would guess the training ground. And then if not, maybe the door. Probably we can check there. Yeah. We can check there, uh, see if uh, we find either any of Terra or this person and then stick around if necessary. Yeah. I couldn't tell if that was him. Um, they're really far away, so I'm unsure. No, that's the captain. Oh, dang it. Oh, I do Excuse me. believe I see him. Yes. Yes? I wanted to give an apologies for uh, what transcribed on the ship. And the way we treated you was unfairly to all of you students, did not treat you with the respect that you deserved. And I, as the captain, wanted to give a genuine apology. I wasn't aware of what you all went through and everything you have done. So, sincerely, I apologize. And I hope in the future we can make good allies. You'll always have a friend in Captain Pumpkin Patch. <laughs> if you ever need anything, come ask. Genuinely, I'm sorry. Thank you. The sentiment is appreciated. Of course. And if you ever want any more alcohol, just come ask me. I have plenty of my special stuff on board. I will keep that in the back of my head. Me and you need to have a, a drink off one time, eh? That's a deal. Shake on it. <laughs> Aye. You as well, boy. <laughs> Uh, uh, Thank you. <laughs> I'm just trying to give my apologies and sentiments to everyone. Me and Red had a speak after witnessing what happened today. We just... We realized uh, we weren't the best. We did get you from point A to point B, but we, we could have been nicer about it. We didn't realize the things you... Can't call you kids, you aren't kids. You people went through. You truly are brave individuals. 
It's all right. Most people don't know about the... Uh, or never has played a uh, Rift Beast before. If you ever need, come call for me. I can help with a lot of things. And if you ever want a sparring match, I am the frontliner of the ship. I don't find doing some training with you, treating you a thing or two. Sure. Of course. <laughs> I'll be talking to Solus over there in a bit, probably, when he's not busy burning things. I need to see him actually do that, so... That doesn't sound like a good time, Thank because you. we need to Again. talk with the guy he's talking with, so that's perfect. Perfect. Perfect tipping. Do I have permission as well to practice my magic on some of the dummies back there for a little bit as well? Yes, so long as you don't light them on fire. Make sure you inform <laughs> Professor Octavian. He'll be overwatching most of your melee combat studies. He will want to know when you're going to be doing this. Mm. Yes, sir. Thank you again. I'll, I'll go apologize for melting the sword. Oh, pardon me, Her Solus. I do have to say, Mr. Caldwell, an impressive display of teaching. I would have probably given more of an analogy of the equivalent of fire traveling up a tree once it burns, the same equivalent to the sword, but you've probably, you have quite a bit more understanding when it comes to that. However, he is not from Severo. He does not think how we think. <laughs> what is it? must be adjusted to him. Understandably so, and that is why you're the professor, and I am just the one inquiring with the Rosewood Academy. Please continue. Professor, Ambassador, we were um, just walking around and do the stand of Just want to check how uh, how you were doing and uh, how's your um, staying so far, despite the uh, events has done its core. When it comes to the events of Madame Skyat, I'm still terribly sorry that you as students had to witness such a thing. And of course, from me, as well as the entirety of the Setting Sun, my deepest condolences for your loss. About myself, though, I have so far gotten myself a room and as well acquainted with most of the professors, as well as some of the students. But uh, there might be a small inquiry when it comes to the students tomorrow. I was perhaps planning that... Of course, if the professors are fine with it, as well as Councillor Malik, that perhaps the students themselves introduce me to the Rosewood Academy as well as their grounds. That sounds like an interesting idea. If your goal is to meet Absolutely. the students, that's probably the best way to do it. In the end of the day, I could, of course, ask the teachers the entire time about what the beauty of Rosewood is, I can understand that, but that does not help if they are supposed to be teaching you. I want to see if their teachings are fruitful, and of course want to see what you all have to say about your own school. I hope that when this time comes, that of course the teachers are allowed to accompany their specific teams, but that while it happens, that the talking of professors will be kept at a minimum. That everything that will be taught to me will come out of a student's mouth, unless they are emergency corrections. Well, just to ask with the other professors, make sure most investors are escorted by a professor. <laughs> Understandably this so. Is partially for safety of the students ah of course i understand that have, have there been in the past problems with investors doing something with students no problems however as i said they've all been escorted so it's very hard to allow very something well. to happen very well and i will also follow the rules once uh, the time comes absolutely but until then of course if you we should talk to him, Mr. Harris. Then, by all means, I do not wish to in <laughs> keep you from that. Do you believe I want to speak to Emma and Varys for a minute? Fuck! Absolutely. And I will be leaving. Shit. By all means, I hope uh, you and Professor Octavian don't mind. I was just going to inquire about how the education for when it comes to combat is happening. I hope you do not mind me just being a spectator. 
is the combat very professor. Well. So. Very well, then I will do so. Do you have a fine day if we do not meet? Motherfucker! I was going to ask you how you were both doing, but seeing how Emma relaxed very quickly when the investor left, yeah. you're not doing the worst. Mm. But how are the two of you doing? Personally, it's just um, questioning the some things. Me and Emma were tasked with um, checking it up on the cage, so we are a bit um, concerned about how the situation developed. That's all I wish to know as well. You'd seen some of the professors have investigated. I'm unsure if you've spoken to Bombadil. I believe he's checked the container himself. We've been uh, wanting to, but we haven't run into him yet. Well, most likely he'll be around his classroom. However, from what I have heard, most all of the safety measures on our side were correct. Hmm. I was there when they investigated further, but something to keep a little quiet and away from the investor. And the way Bombadil spoke of it, sounded like there was tampering involved. We do not know by who, or for what purpose. So, you are going to investigate this keep it quiet from the new students, and the investor, as well as the captain and his crew. That's what we're trying to, sir. Non-speaker. Good. It is, um, I'm asking what is um, your opinion on the uh, investor? Currently, I'm unsure. He speaks highly of me, which is strange. I understand some people may respect what I did in Favira before I left, but using words such as legendary is a little off putting. He has been trying to make sure he's close to students as well, which, so far, I do not, you know, I'm not really keen on. Especially considering one of our last investors was from around Palvindor. Palvindor? Yeah. No, I don't think he's out here. I'm not sure, truthfully. Do not consider him a friend right now. Anything you uh, would like to ask the professor? No. Right. If you would like, both like to step this way real quick. This way I can keep an eye on everyone who is approaching us. Emma, this is unofficial. Speak freely. Anything you say right now will not be held against you. Indeed, the investor might have something to do with the tampering. That's what we're trying to find out. Well, speak to Bombadil. Not yet. We still uh, spoke to Takuya. Investigated. Good. If you can, figure out which professors were actively investigating it. Work with them if you can. Yes, sir. If you yes, can sir. ask questions, make sure you tell your team your investigations are a little more hush-hush. It's not that I don't trust 
the other students, it's that I do not trust all of them to keep their mouths shut. Elantia will... Well, both of you have experienced. Hmm. Yes, sir. What happened to Sky is a shame. I wish it did not happen. And if we can figure out who did it, who was the cause of it, all the better. But for now, do what you can. Do what you think you need to. If you need to do something, and you believe the other professors will get, will get you in trouble for it, inform me first. If it is very dangerous, I will escort so that the other professors will be off your back. But if it is important information, and you believe it is important for the investigation, inform the professors who know. Yes, sir. Well, this may be more talky than this thing, espionage and silence. Well, I'd hope by this point I've made myself very clear on being tight-lipped, so... You don't think you can trust me? Don't. That is your opinion. Do what you think you need to. But again, if you think you'll get in trouble with the other professors, let me know. It's not something too crazy. I will cover for you, so you have my permission. Yes, sir. Hey. Very well. So, let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about today anything and if you need it to be unof unofficial so you can you know be angry without a professor yelling at you let me know my classroom is usually unlocked yes sir good day to the both of you remember sundown we'll be having a funeral yes sir thank you sir Right. Well, it is. Start to all the uh, trying to talk with Professor Pomber till then. Yep. I want to look at that lock, at least hear what happened to that lock. Be okay. Ow. I'm fine. I, I hate the oh. cold, extremely. Oh, well, okay, then. Um, <laughs> Inspector Ferris, Detective Emma, ba da ba 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 da. No, Bumbadil. Um, you all right? Yeah, I just keep getting a headache right around that door. <laughs> all 
All right. Um, is there a way for us to knock or? Uh... I think we just knock. Knock, knock. There's a Bombadale. Any anybody home? Can hear anything. Where could he be? <laughs> Only thing I can think about is that probably they're in if the thing is still there. Yeah, but we're not allowed in there. Shit. He... Sometimes I feel the um, institution is a tad, tad little bit thick. Sometimes. Sometimes. Hmm. For a second I turned around and I thought uh, that was Professor Tom Battle because of the height. Oh. Yeah. Mr. Bombadil, small guy, big mustache. Have you seen him? Mama. Can All you right. go into the infirmary and see if he's in over there? I didn't speak like that. Wow. Thank you. Thank you very much. I think not a good idea that we should move around too much, but people can see us. That is true. <sighs> Got Waven. Oh. For some reason, I feel like I've been standing for um, quite a few hours without uh, sitting at all. Or walking. Yeah. No? Okay, thank you. No? All right, thank you very much. Oh. Good to see all of you back safe. Give you a shiny rock. Oh. Hello. You're welcome. Oh. Yeah, go good to be back and everything. It's great. Real, real great. As bad as it ever was, but... At least it's not a boat. So needs another boat. That that is true. <laughs> I'll leave you to it. Go. What's up plan now? So, uh, Professor Pombatil is probably our uh, go-to at the moment. I'm not sure if we have any other leads. Well, the arena is of limits. We cannot uh, walk in without targeting uh, on us. Whoops. For the moment, at least. Yeah, so there's no help from there. Hmm. Hmm. There is an option, but uh, I don't think it's a good one. Let me hear it anyway. There will be one time during the... Uh, today that the arena will be empty. As much as I love that idea, and I, I, I can't not describe it straight enough, I love that idea. My, my mom taught me better than that. I know, I do feel the same, but... Uh, the idea of uh, that someone else is gonna realize that has me worried. I know. 
So maybe we need to keep an eye out for uh, someone that is not around during the time of the day. Sounds good. <sighs> At least they're playing for that. I honestly really thought we were gonna get off that boat, put the roof wherever the fuck it needed to go, and then we were all gonna have a grand welcome back party. That's what I was hoping. I really did thought too that uh, there's gonna be a good celebration. Terra managed to capture one of the rift bit and uh, brought it back with uh, no inconvenience at all. Mm. And this is what happened at the end. Fucking sucks. At least we did good out there. For what it's worth. That is true. And I understand that nobody blames blame us for anything, but uh, it uh, doesn't feel right, nonetheless. It really doesn't, doesn't it? God, when I find out who tamper with those fucking locks. But to start having a good uh, look at uh, how was temper will probably give us some ideas about what happened. It uh, was heat or um, cold or some corrosive, corrosive substance or any of the sort. Mm. But if it was just a brute force in some way. If in brute force, I'm sure someone would have heard it. It might have been something smaller. Maybe Apart like from that, uh... a knife, maybe? Trying to picklock it. If they tried to picklock it uh, and using a knife, we will have left a bunch of scratches around the lock. Yeah. So if they did try that, they to just be stealthy about it, probably a better lockpick. I mean, th th we'll find out when we get our hands on Bombadil. And hopefully he can tell us if there was something weird about the locks. Do you have any idea where it, uh, where it happened? No. My, my best guess. I, I assume it might have happened on the boat. Because we were all there when we were taking it off the boat. And surely someone would have noticed if someone was tampering with the lock while getting it off the boat. Surely. So it might have happened while we were still traveling or like during the night. Excuse me. No, crazy. Oh no. Brutal. I just realized I was the. I realized that I was thinking about the, what I was saying, but not actually saying it. I was think, oh, saying yeah. that. Um, it, it um, if it happened during the boat and the rift bit didn't go out during the night, like, will the rift bits have enough intelligence to wait for it to uh, get to their destination and get out in a better position? I don't think so. What I know, Rifbees are not that smart. They they go they go for the kill. That's that's what they are fueled by. 
my my best guess is that they tamper with the lock enough for it to get loose. So when it got carried around and it got wiggled around and carried and, and got all wild up, that's when it decided to go about. And then the lock we would were have been loose. it, right? What? Were we sedating the rift beast or uh, was just the kitchen itself? And what I know that we just tied it down and then kept it in the in the box because the box was uh, fueled with uh, all kind of uh, 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 potion stuff, uh, bombadil stuff. It was alchemically uh, treated to uh, yeah. be uh, to make sure resistant to acid. Yeah, to make sure it didn't come out. That was the plan for it, it to stay in the box. So. When if uh, the lock was loose and it get riled up, then surely you could like have pushed against where the lock was and then made its way out. <sighs> yes. I don't get it. I. W what purpose for what what? <sighs> There are two options. One that uh, it was just to get it free and just cause some havoc. Or the other one, if it was specifically to try to kill the professor. But that will be rather specific and I'm unsure who will have anything against her. And how would they know exactly that it would attack her? Like, we were all standing there right next to her. It could have attacked any of us. So if it was specifically for her, how would it? How would that person know it would go against her? Are, uh, hmm. Do we know if Rixby are attracted to something specifically? Maybe some the kind of pheromone or something was uh, doused to the professor without her noticing. Oh, shit, I don't remember. I, I, I think there was something. I... Don't recall. I, I feel like there's something about them being attracted to mana, but I, I could be completely wrong and they just go about. I, I, I really just think that they just go wherever they go. Kind of like a wild animal. They hear a sound and then they go attracted to that sound. But we were all there. So surely it couldn't specifically have been against her. <sighs> and if it was, then they definitely planned it throughout the whole trip. We have quite a few questions and some of the answers will be um, quite substantial to uh, reduce the number of uh, suspects if that is the case. Yeah. Let's go for a walk. Don't smack the couch. I'm sorry. I, I think it was my knee that hit the couch really hard. <laughs> well, let's go for a walk. Maybe the investor guy finally is going about his day alone. We get in a little chat with him. And you, you sure you are good with talking with him, right? Yes, why wouldn't I be? I don't know, it's just... I don't know, I'm just... I'm I'm thinking about you, I'm thinking about your well-being. That's what I'm doing. Well, I'm pretty sure I, you have my back, so... Of course. As long as you're around, then I'll be pretty fine. Yeah, I got your back, man. But still, I wouldn't force you to talk with him if you didn't want to. <sighs> I 
sådan set. I mean, I guess we should go to the graveyard. Let's get going then. Have you ever been to a funeral before? I've um, been to the funerals that my family and the tribe held, but uh, I'm pretty sure they were quite different from the ones that are going to be held here. They Maybe. were um, just more of a celebration of a familiar or loved one that is returning to nature in mm. some way than another. Since uh, most of the passings that we had were by natural means. I guess. The, um, the ones that we had were a long time ago. Yeah. And it was because of Rispies. And I'm honestly too yeah. young to remember. Thank you. Thank you. What are... Did you know that the first time I saw a wrist uh, this was when I was um, around uh, five years old? Mm, well, that makes sense. The wrist pieces didn't come about, about for about a decade. They'll make you like 15 now. Are you 15? A decade? No, I'm not. I'm pretty sure you have 20 years. No, I'm... Pretty positive is like only 10 years. And I have my time right. Right. I'll have to uh, take my notebook. Said. Yeah, because I, I had a discussion about that with some teachers when they were asking a lot of questions about my, my beautiful art in Winter Storms. Uh, right. And, and I honestly told them that I couldn't remember at this point. I just assumed that I was kind of young. And, uh, yeah, I was, I was pretty sure it was like 10 years ago, but, uh, uh, sorry, 20 years, but you might be right, it might be 10. Yeah, I believe they said that it was like a decade ago the recipe started coming about. So you might have been a little bit older than just five. Let's just say that I was young and, you know, dramatic events. Yeah, that, that's also that. Dramatic events can really fuck with your brain. So that's also that. Go to the side. We are kind of in the middle. Many a times we did not see eye to eye. I have truly respected and honored the lessons that you taught me. And that you taught a lot of people. Are the hardest lessons I think there are to teach. The adversarial nature of most of your lessons, your questioning of our very beings, our beliefs, your insistence on challenging our mindset, on teaching us the hard ways of life. These are truths and challenges that are meaningful and that we all have to face. If in the past, and for certain in the future, and they 
are difficult to teach. At least in such an atmosphere like this. The best way for people to learn these sorts of things is when their life is in direct danger, but you somehow manage to do that without without losing the meaning of what you were trying to teach us. Never once did you say for certain that these were lessons that I would come to care about, but I do. I believe that your silence is the only cover when we are in battle and we are fighting for our life. Because you are here for the call. You are here trying to make a difference. At least do this right. She's always up my eyes about being an etiquette. Well, at least I can fucking do it to her fucking funeral. gonna talk to Sayak because I'm skeptical whether the dead can hear us or not. And if she can, I'm not sure if it matters. So I prefer to talk to the living instead. Kayak was not a good person. But that's why I came to care for her. As our advisor from the invented, she told me to not be weak. She reminded me that this battle that we fight, there is no glory to be seek. We are not heroes. We are simply surviving in a world that is ending. And we are trying our best to make sure that won't happen. There is no honor in our battle. We have to use <coughs> every way we can to survive. We can never become animals. This is a reminder that no matter how much protected, how strong we think we are, any slip, whether it be by fate or our mistake, can lead to us in our life. This is a reminder. That as long as we live, as long as we can keep walking, no matter how much we lose, no matter if we lose our limb, no matter if we lose our friends, our family, our home, as long as we're breathing, as long as we can't stand, we cannot let the fire inside of us dim. Fight with everything you have. Fight for the fallen and hope that one day we do not have to come together like this. We do not have to bury our dead. That is all. I don't like the words I'm sorry because I'm sorry means that we made a mistake. So instead of saying I'm sorry for her loss, I'm just gonna say thank you all for being alive.
I did not get to know Skyeth as well as many others here today. I did know, however, that she came here for a purpose. The same reason we all are here for, I hope. I... I'm sad that she is gone, and that the only thing I can do is to say words, which I'm not really good at in the common tongue. My people have a saying that no one is actually truly gone until the last person who remembers their name perishes from the world. As sentimental as it is, I know that still losing a loved one and only having the memory of their face or their name doesn't really fill that gap in someone's life. But instead of focusing on the empty gap, think of the the gaps that were filled in your life for knowing them, however small, however big, everything that they did, everything that they were. If we all together hold on to that, we can do good by them. I did not know the other three here, and I wish I could have. But I know that there are those of you here who did know them. Their names, every is everything. Mier Volastua, Banpri Kag Sarao, Hauga Kag Nutri, Ata, Ux Osri Vei, Yumer Vei Desk, Vir Hooper, Kag Lokor, Ag Veni, Inir Vinele, Ux Osri Vei, Yumer Vei, Itasi, Skos Kavi, Virada, Persavik, Tiagoi, Ux Osri Vei, Yumer Ver, Vei is Quintiv. Tar di comada, tag hardi, tag rum algo, ux osri vei. Yumever itasi, tag mishti, vas si majaka, si lex. Sinidal sit, jaka, tag, malrak, vei osri ux. I'm going to be completely honest. When I first met you, I thought you were an absolute asshole. The first, one of the first interactions we ever had was you putting me in punishment. And I, I didn't know what to say. I just thought the worst. With time, spending time with you, even though you had your own way of saying these things, I know you cared. I know you were doing this for us. And the culmination of that was when I saw you fight alongside us in Canvale with your insides almost falling out. Caleb had to basically put them back in for you. I thank you for teaching us and for being with us. May you rest in peace, Miss Garrett. You will be missed. I don't have much I can say for having already been said. But I know this won't be the last. And because of that, I, all I can do is try and try to be better. And ensure that we leave this as little as we can. And that we achieve what we set out here to do. I appreciate your sacrifice, Professor. 
I'll never forget you. Let's go home. Unless there is anybody else who wishes to make a public statement of grief or farewell to the fallen, that will be it for tonight, I believe. Thank you, Thank you all for coming and paying your respects. friend and ally. You inspired people to be higher, to be better than they were. You acted tough when you cared, when you needed to. You carried a heavy burden on your shoulders, just as everyone else did. And that burden has turned into a passion of flame, one that has fit with the students and staff beyond what is of the mortal plane. Rest now and enjoy the red wine beyond here. We will meet once again sometime. You doing all right? <sighs> yeah, I'm okay. That's good. Well, I need some sleep. I wasn't speaking. Then once again, I would like to say thank you all for coming to pay your respects. You are dismissed.
Så sad jeg flås der i græsset. Nej. I want to go up and say something. I don't want to do what everybody's up there still. We had asked them to escort her to a party twice. To drink with all of you. No, you two are. What? Huh? It appears. Second. Yeah, I'm good. Just, uh, just watch it in the funeral. Yeah. Um, you guys know the way back. I'm not really sure how to get back to the school from here. Oh, um, I can take her. I can take her. I can take her. I might have to leave soon. But, uh, someone arrived just at the and it wasn't here before. Take a rest, So, keep an eye out as much as you can. We'll talk tomorrow. Yeah. Some rest when you can do, all right? Yeah, I will. Take it easy. You too. Did you feel the hands of her grave? <laughs> You're really out the culprit. You're gonna pay so heavy for that. I know I'm just a guest, but if there's any way that I can help in aiding and softening that loss, I will gladly do so. Yeah, Not yeah, as a follower of the setting sun, but as Will myself. you be alright? Will you be close? What? Usually combat in arms is something we've all experienced one way or another either directly in person or to hearing one another. It's been not easy, but I can safely say that seeing all of you, and I'm sure you all have your own experience with Gaius and her teachings. Yeah. She's still a friend of yours. And the way she spoke about you when she introduced me to the possibility of your choice. In her own way, respectful. Well, Hell i vore dit navn, komme dit rige, skete en vilje, som vi ledes, som vi ledes også på jorden. Giv os i dag vores daglige brød, og forlad os vores skyld, så vi også forlader vores skynder. Lad os ikke ind i kristelsen, og gå for de onde, til det rige og magten og ære i alt det, vi hedder. Fra jord du kom, til jord du gik. Something that will fuel us 
all. It's not this. No one lives for better for this. For better world. world. Last week. The recommendation of Fel to even make these teachings is all possible. Do continue in the morning for that. That includes the world. I got really butchered that, didn't I? I can't remember how it goes. I'll be fine. The clock should be ticked. Whether we like it or not. You can both grieve in his own way. Ah, she does. Det var ikke en i fristen som før. It was a... Don't do the sin thing he said. And then the bread afterwards. Fuck. Um. Staying for a bit. That's all. We should not see each other until tomorrow. I wish you all a wonderful night. To you as well. Thank you. Sorry. Hey, little buddy. You don't need to tell anymore. I don't Nothing to be so very bad. Go home. Enjoy your rest. And also, I found out a little bit about Fallen of Gaia as well, so... The Iron Token meant to be you seem to be having quite the pleasant conversation. We showed up together. I passed on by. No? No. Meow? No? Okay. We're good. We're okay. Teachings about Gaia, at least to our group. Are you turning to the clear of the Not much about Gaia, but I'd be interested uh, interested in hearing a little more. Do you um Excuse me. It's Ow. an uh, interpretation to guide oh, yeah. Do you miss the message? The picture music? Mm. Okay. Mm. 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 I know. I know I may be in uh, this first or eyes, but I've been talking to the people on the boat yeah. and wanted to give my apologies for what has occurred. Not the way we treated you. We weren't quite aware of the situation yeah, you were all put into and underestimated what you've gone through. And after me and Red had to speak, uh, I, don't blame it all I wanted to apologize sincerely and make sure that in the future we can be of good help. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Lil. Take your picture. I want to ask you something. Of course. It means something to you. Me too. Captain Pumpkin Patch will always be there for allies and other people. And you did your best. Yes. I hope I you know that. Help. That's all we've ever wanted to do. You'll always have an outline. Don't, don't, don't put this on yourself. I'm sure you will be able to help with it. Do you want to go get something to eat or some water or something? I wish I could have helped you. Yeah. There's only so much you can keep telling yourself. I know. But we're here. We get stronger, aren't we? How much? You did what you could. To the future. To the future. I turn my gun on. I don't need to know this. It's all okay. The dead will listen, so but they never talk back. They really do. You enjoy the rest of your night. Yeah, you too. I'd like to talk to you later. I'll be by the boat house. She was like a mentor to you. Really, I'm sorry. Well, you were the only one keeping my back up by inventors, that's for sure. Hmm. I really cared about 
Yeah. Especially it is. Age. Yeah. But perhaps in the future. She was a good teacher. We can avoid such tragedies from happening. Again, the more reason why I need to figure out what happened to that box. Yeah. By the way, what do you know about that elf? Guy from the sunset, something or another? A bit too cozy, that's what he is. Too cozy, huh? Yeah. Food teachers don't like how he's going about. Yeah. Seems a little strange. And we're just gonna talk to him and see if we can figure something out. We didn't get the chance. Do you know why he's here? I'm not completely sure. So far, he seemed interested in getting some of the students into his uh, thing. I'm not sure. Thing? Yeah, his uh, group, the. Uh, the, the, the falling sun, or whatever they call themselves. I don't know. What do they... What do they do? What is he? I'm not sure. From what I can understand, he's kind of like us, but like a smaller group. And he's trying to get some people mm. from here in the, to his side. Oh. Trying to find allies, I guess? Sounds like it. But of course, can't know for sure. Right. Mm. I don't like it. Me neither. That's one thing it was the worst guy get that was the one in the way. It could have been anybody. Wait, are you saying you think it was... I don't think she yeah. was the target. Not intentionally. Mm. I think she was just... unlucky to be right in front of the door. Sure, he was hoping that it would get out... later. Definitely. No? When there wasn't an entire crowd to take care of it. Yeah. Hmm. By the way, um, how are you liking being on Terra? Well, it was good. Until all this happened. Right. I felt like I was actually doing something good for once. You did do good. I didn't do good enough. I should have ticked the hey. box before getting off the boat. Don't blame yourself. None of us could have suspected that someone was going to tamper with the box. No, but I checked that box every day since we caught it. I don't know why I did not check it one last time before getting off the boat. Just one last time. It's not your fault. I just wanted to do something good. Just one. For once, I did not want to be a failure. I 
You're not a failure. For all intents and purposes, you succeeded in your mission. We captured a rift beast, we got it back here, all in one piece. That on its own is pretty incredible. I'm not even sure I could have done something like that. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna have a sort of wake, I think, at the um campfire at the dorms. Sorry, I'm getting a bottle. But uh Sure. If you guys want to drink something. <clears throat> Thanks. Besides, I don't think Skyette would want you to wallow for her sake. Not just that. All we can do now is prove that, well, prove that someone tampered with it, find the culprit, and hold him accountable. And that's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. It's been really boring, dark by the is, way. Uh, the last, whoa. Dark as fuck. Dark as fuck. Yeah. It's dark as fuck. Oh, uh, hi, so, Professor. Sorry. Um, greetings. Greetings. Um, hmm. Don't mind us. We're just stopping to get some late night uh, food. And, uh, oh, I'm Luca, by the way. Oh, you're the one um, Emma was mentioning. Oh? Yeah, she talked about you on the boat where I believe she, she talked about your hard work that you and her did and spoke quite fondly of it. Oh, uh, yeah, the Aether Tech stuff. Yeah, we've been working really hard. Aether Tech? You have an interest in Aether Tech as well? Mm, yes, sir. I uh, made this, actually. Because I lost my original sword. Let me see if I can pull it out. <clears throat> it's, um... Kind of just a base right now. It's not really got any... Things to it. But Philia helped me put it together. This last month or so. Well, we're it, um... Theoretically, I should be able to put some <laughs> Aetherite stuff in there. In the holes, you know? And then that can empower the blade with different things. That's the hope, anyway. I suppose that is a very primitive process, but doable. Hmm. But you speak as if you have some small understanding of it. Did you just recently start to go interest in it? Well, my, um, uh, my family is actually sword crafters, uh, Aethertech sword crafters specifically. Oh. So they kind of specialize in that. I didn't really get a chance to learn from them, but I've been picking it up, I feel like, pretty quick here. Oh. I assume it's because of her, then. Yeah. Emma, and also lately, Philia. Oh. Uh, she's um, a student in Team Ignis. I'm being replaced hmm. with Philia. I don't believe I've I'm gone for her. one month, and then oh, suddenly wait, Philia actually, gets in the picture. Are you referring to the one with the white hair? Ooh. Mm -mm. No, Philia's got um, darker, kind of like orangish, curly hair. She's, um, I think, out sick today, or slept in late, or something. Hmm. Well, don't let me keep you to whatever it was you were doing this late at mm. night, alone. Uh, just getting food, sir, for the uh, party or the wake. Party. Yeah, there's gonna be a wake, so we were gonna get some food and stuff for people. Oh, I see. Well then, do carry on. I'll be on my <laughs> way. Thank you, sir. Of course. Oh, um, I didn't formally. Introduce myself. Monty Evoid. Ah. Uh, what was that last name? Evoid. Evoid. Edward. Evard? 
Et yeah. word. Et vach. Like Edward Bud. Evoy. Edward. Mm, understood. Pleasure to meet you, Professor Edward. Ed Edward. 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 You'll get it. <laughs> Don't worry. Have a good night. You too, sir. Uh, yeah. He seems nice. He's the new Aethertech professor. Uh, yeah. We talked a little bit on the boat. Uh. Mm. I, I assume he knows his stuff uh, because of uh, his eye and, and his wings and uh, his his claw. Yeah, and like the little thing on his chest? What uh, is that? I I know. I, I, I think it's his heart. I, it's a heart. Yeah, he mentioned this really funky thing about uh, Cecilia, and and she helped him save his life. Something he was dying, and then plopped that thing on, and that keeps him alive. Some something. Who's Cecilia? Cecilia, you know, long long hair princess Lumen. Oh, she was with you guys. No, we didn't see her, but. Apparently, he met her and she saved his life. Oh. Wow. Small world, huh? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Probably should have come here in the light. Um. Steak? I could really use a steak. We've been eating weird fruit and fish. And some beef jerky. Ew. Root? You have been eating your potatoes, right? Uh. Right, right. Anyway, tell me about the boat trip. Luca, you have been eating your potatoes, huh? right? Uh. Hmm. So your boat trip. Tell me about your boat trip. I'll tell you about the boat trip when you are, uh, tell me about the potatoes. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Have you eaten them? Um. Have I, um, have I, would I, uh. Oh, hey guys. Hello. Hello. Lumen, can you tell me have Luke was... been eating his potatoes? Is that a problem? Well, it's not a problem Can until I find out. Potatoes? Uh, look over there. You, you can't fool me. <laughs> Eat your potatoes. They make you nice and strong. But I'm already nice and strong. On meat. Just meat. You don't want to waste professor. food. Exactly. I gave you a chance, Luca. That's all I can do for you. Oh. Dang it. <laughs> really gotta be more attentive. <laughs> Missed opportunity! <laughs> Thanks but for the potatoes. Strong, you gotta eat your potatoes. I'm big and strong now. Kind of. I've been working out with Caden. I mean, yeah, you look bigger, I guess. I mean, I could just... I I could I just could crush his arm like a grape. Mm. Like, I'm not... <laughs> okay, well, that's thin. not nice. It's pretty thin. No, not I mean, look at my calves. Oh, no, well, I mean, how do you work you this part out? This is so hard to work things out. It's it. It doesn't build muscle. Yeah, I swing and I swing and I swing, and it just stays oh, no. kind of. My leg is falling off. Oh like no. That. Just get more meat on your bones. Simple. You gotta eat. Well, I'm not built like that. Potatoes. Well, potatoes help with protein. <laughs> How? And protein well, for meat. Yeah, and potatoes. Protein mm -hmm. was a bad example, but it gives you oh, your my. vitamins and stuff. Mm. You have not been eating your potatoes, have you? So what were you getting? Do you have any of the wine? Um, no. Cecilia, uh, I don't... Might be some they're good for you. I'm wondering if, mm. if we do, we'll put a bottle at the grave. 
at least one potato a day. That's all I'm asking. Anything made for us? A day? It's one. Mm -hmm. One. One a day? That's so many potatoes. That's one. It's not gonna kill you. One a day. That's thirty potatoes a month. <laughs> that's so many. Oh God, that was so. It tastes fun. I mean, they're kind of like. I mean, it's when they have butter on them, it's nice. What what, okay, what what don't you like about them? Uh, they're a vegetable. Luca. No. That's true. You can't tell Why? Me. Have you ever tried mashed potatoes? Why? Mmm. I mean, they're always kind of mushy, right? I mean, some people yeah, eat them raw. You can mash them up, like, without the skin on them. You can make it into, like, uh... If you make it, like, you know... You can make it, turn it into a soup, in a way. <sighs> Fine, I'll try your potato sludge soup. <laughs> Wow, okay, well, <laughs> thanks, Luca. <laughs> really putting the confidence in me right now. Look. I'll try it. <laughs> try it, It'll, it's healthy for you. That's fucking tea. Good for you, proteins. And, and little secret, you can make alcohol out of these. What? Mm -hmm. Have I got I know it in my what hand? you're speaking of. It's... It's very dark. I think we should just What? Them go. Potatoes. You can turn them into alcohol. Uh, now you're just making stuff up. This, no, it's true. A, a, a dude at a bar told me. Mm. A dude at a bar? Yeah. He said he has like a whole stash of potatoes. That he then does this like weird like thing with. Good to go. And then get out the liquid, and then he like let it stand up for long periods of time or something like that, and, and then it turns into alcohol. I have no idea <laughs> what kind of wizardry. Since when do you go to bars? It, it was. Right, let's go. Listen, I had to go somewhere when I was running away from my aunt. Luca, I'm gonna come back, and if you haven't eaten those potatoes, I'm I'm gonna chase you down. Okay. Can't catch those me. Potatoes, I swear. That goes pretty fast. I thought Probably I'm running not, from the But I know yesterday. where you live. Let's go. Uh oh. Seeing ominous things and leaving. It's Lumen's thing now, is it? <laughs> kind of seems that way. Have a good night. It's one potato. You're you not going to die. Fine. <laughs> Come on, chew. It didn't kill you. It's okay, I guess. You, you just gotta eat the potato first, and then afterwards you eat the steak. Then you get all the potato taste out. Uh. Is that easy? <laughs> I guess so. Mm. Fine. Okay. But in return, you have to do something for me. Oh, okay. What's up? You gotta smile. Uh, I don't know, Luca. After this day, I'm, I'm not really up for smiling. Come on. Uh, Smiling's good for you. Uh, it's the potatoes of the soul. Wow, can't believe you used a potato against me. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, Come on, one smile. Uh, Kyle, you're not even trying. I I am very much trying. I don't I don't think I can smile. I am trying. <laughs> There's a smile. Uh, uh. Perfect. Uh. All right, contract sealed. Oh, okay. Now that I threw your plate across the room, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna throw this stuff away. Uh, that sounds good. 
with the <laughs> it, it probably the gloves they they're they're a little bit sticky probably hmm and because they keep grabbing the plate oh yeah something about static electricity or something like that some kind of resonance thing i don't know oh yeah i did hear something about the uh, rubbing yourself against the wall and then you actually make electricity by yourself Never heard of that. But hey, guess what? What? While you were gone, I uh, perfected a spell. Or like, well, it's the same spell as before, but I changed it. Oh, changed it how? Well, you want to see? Yeah. Okay. Don't tell the professors. My lips are sealed. And... <laughs> oh! Ooh, that looks static. Ta-da! Yeah, well, it's kind of like, um... Well, maybe I shouldn't touch it. I but probably a bad idea. <laughs> basically, Professor Nella taught me, like, if I... Focused on kind of like this push and pull thing. I didn't really understand it at first, but I think the way my magic works is kind of different from a normal caster like Zuku. Huh. Maybe, well, Zuku is also kind of special, isn't he? Like with horns and stuff, like a demon and stuff like that. That's true. Yeah, I assume that magic would work but differently. I think... Excuse me. Oh, bless you. Um, I think... Thank you. <laughs> I think that my affinity is different. Huh, maybe. Different how? Yeah. Because... Well, every time I've tried to use lightning affinity techniques, it backfires on me. Yeah, I, I remember. But when I try to do... Yeah, yeah, you remember. So... When I try it this way, and I kind of just focus on the push and pull, and try and make separation, if that makes sense, of space, hmm. it works a lot better. I backlash a lot less uh, often. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Push and pull. Yeah. Push hmm. and pull. Something like that. Push and pull. Okay. I don't know why it works, but it does. Yeah. I mean, wasn't there also something about meditation also should work or something? I don't know. I don't understand magic. Mm. I've been meditating. I've been working out with Caden. I've been working on these spells. I've been working with Philly on this Aethertech sword. I've been doing all kinds oh, of yeah. stuff this last I month I hear you're replacing me with Philly. I hear. Not, no. I'm not replacing you. It's just... She's really good at Aethertech. Plus... She totally saved my life. So, we're kind of like really good buddies now. Buddies, I see. Aethertech buddies? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So while I was oh, out on. risking my life for a month, you were getting buddy-buddy elbowed with Philia, I see. <laughs> it's not my, like that. My come heart on. is breaking, Luke. I can't believe you would do this to me. I thought we were Aethertech buddies. How dare you? We are either tech buddies. Yeah, we are. But I can have up to five either tech buddies at a uh, time. Five? And I thought you yep. were committed. I mean, spread the Aether tech love, you know? Is this about the harem thing we talked about last fall? Huh? The 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 thing with having more than one partner? Is it the same with Apotech having one more Apotech buddies? Well, no, it's just a, it's a good number, you know? You can have up to five close friends, up to five working friends. It's just a good number. Uh-huh. Team number. But 
The team numbers are six, Luca. Well, I'm the sixth. Uh, so, me, Philia, and who else? Um, I don't know. I don't have any other Aether Tech bodies. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe Val. God damn it, Val is good. Can't blame you on that one. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's literally yeah. all Aether Tech. He's scary, though. He's really scary. Really? How? Yeah. Well, so Vesper was showing off his magic earlier. Uh, the new guy. And it turns out he's like really good at poison magic. And mm. the way that Val just kind of sat there and looked at him with like complete total attentiveness and focus. I could tell he was concocting stuff. Are you sure he just wasn't being attentive? Well, usually he sits like, you know, have his arms crossed or he'll like sit back and blah, blah, blah. But he was just sitting there like watching. Eh, I don't know. I think Val is pretty neat. I mean, he I is. I think he saw. Six. He is neat, but. You know, he saw like the poison gas cloud that he could make and he just goes. You know? I am. I guess. Uh, I, tr I trust well with my his, my life. He tr he saved my life back, uh, back then. Oh, no, absolutely. Yes, I, I trust that man Wait, with my did? life. Tell me the story. Oh, you know, when uh, my legs kind of stopped uh, working, probably out of anxiety or something, and because of all the acid, and uh, I was looking straight at my team, the Aventus, uh, straight in the eyeball as they were walking away from me, abandoning me in the battlefield. Val came and uh, dragged me out. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, we were all kind of in the middle of a battlefield, so of course we wouldn't. Well, yeah, that means saving my That's life. That's scary. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I had kind of a similar thing with Philia. Whenever um, we were running from the final uh, large one, I forget what they call it. Oh, yeah, I'm so done but, with uh, the But yeah, the big one. Yeah, I fell, and I couldn't get back up. Um, Angel dragged me out of there. Wait, no. Wait, no. Philia saved me earlier. Angel's the one that saved me there. Oh. Philia and I got lost, and I was dying, like, really bad. Probably oh. not, wasn't going to make it. Oh. And she carried me alone through, like, miles of woods. Oh. And, like, rift beasts were going around, and we were, like, having to hide from them. And then, you know, at one point I was like, you should just leave me, Philia, because I don't think I'm going to make it. And she said, no, no, I'm not going to do that. And so she she got me all the way back. Hmm. What would you look at that? I mean, at least you can count on your yeah. teammates because they still saved your life afterwards. But uh, if uh, Val hasn't mm. been there, my Aventus have left me for dead. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Mm. Oh. Glad you're okay. I'm, I'm fine. I mean... Still. I mean, in the end, it was, it was a good point for me to leave, I guess. I guess so. E yeah. And okay. Uh, we should get to the wake before people start, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we should. Getting all. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> yep. Um. Oh. Okay, now where is this drink? I got tea. Well, yeah, tea. Tea. Mm. Ah, what the? Okay, I got an idea. Uh, okay. Let's each bring a cup and one of these things. Oh. Uh, well, this oh. looks like some alcohol or something. It, it, yeah. yeah. See, here, take these. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, oh, that's my leg. <laughs> Don't grab that. <laughs> no, I'm not grabbing my leg. You ready? It's hard to see if I'm... Oh, yeah, yeah, I still have them. It's hard to see in the dark. Mm. <laughs> You know, I'm glad you guys came today, because the last five days or so, I've just kind of been waiting, thinking that you guys would show up, and, and I'm starting to get worried. Oh, trust me, you're not the only one. We we were discussing the other night if the, if the, the captain had even pulled on the anchor, and if we were moving the whole day. Hmm. Mm. I'm pretty sure I was getting cabin favors. Yeah. Favorite. Yeah, getting out at sea, you start to lose sight of whether or not you're even going anywhere. Yeah, it was nothing. It was just blue and water everywhere. Like, not even like a little island or or, or something. Mm. So when we started to see those icebergs, oh, that was like, that was the best feeling. Icebergs? Yeah, further out into the ocean. Uh, they started forming icebergs out there. I guess it's just really cold out here. Hmm. Neat. Mm, they were big. I worry um, we were gonna hit it. Well, I'm glad you didn't. Mm. Where did they say it was gonna be at? I assume it was at the dorms. Really or not. Yes. If you're worried about our accommodations, Miss Rose would keep mm. around and told us that we could sleep in the castle if we wanted. She was very kind. Hmm. Must be the dorms then. Probably. I mean, there's a campfire. Let's just start to take it indoors somewhere. Hey, have you heard anything about that god that we supposedly rescued? You know, that quote unquote god of the forest, the one who made the campus all weird? Uh, I haven't heard anything new, but uh, Vesper got uh, all uh, riled up when we were talking about it. He, I think he's a bit riled up, like positively uh, or negatively. Yeah, uh, positively, he he seemed very religious. So, uh, so when mm. we started to talk about, oh, we rescued uh, this uh, child of a uh, Gaia or something, he was ooh ooh, he was he at first like just sticking out everywhere. He was so excited. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Let's see. So Ventus is open. Lumen is open. I think Lumen is the place. Yeah, I guess so. Definitely left off the campfire. Left the campfire and left a torch. Okay. Thank you, I guess. Though these are mere prototypes. Knock, knock! <laughs> if they're prototypes. Hi, Emma. Come on in. It's open. Ah, uh, thank you. Got alcohol. Uh, greetings. Mm. Hey, is this the, um... Of alcohol. Cecilia didn't Where's... take any. Oh. Well... Oh. Well, where's the wake at? The what? The wake? Maybe down in the beach. Oh, there What's was that? a bunch of people sitting outside drinking alcohol, <laughs> and then they went somewhere else to drink alcohol, and now I left and I'm here. Oh, okay. I think it's over. Well, wow. I, I might have I missed it. Yeah, I think it's. Uh, yes, yeah, so there's running over here. That, that was us. Hi. Who was the last person by the campfire? We don't know. Mm. It was not it was me. That's for sure. Uh, Mr. Cadwell. It was. We we're trying to find Act out. Terrace. No, not Act Terrace. Jackson. Uh, Jackson. Captain Jackson. Morgan. Solace. Gallo. Terra. Terra um, team. Terra team was Lafron there. Lafron as well. I've introduced myself to him. The one they What's call Lafron. The and Ignis. Uh oh. Oh well. Your guess is as good as mine. Honestly, I never met him. All right. See if Terra so team the is Doesn't look like it. <sighs> 
I think they went somewhere else. My best guess is a beach. Oh, wait, there's someone. Hmm? Oh. Are you Lexis? Maybe it's Solus. Oh, yeah. My vision is just really bad in the dark for some reason. We should, we should, we should just, we should go this way. Okay. I wonder what Opera is up to. Hmm. Oh, there's a really cool new um, student. They are uh, an illusionist. Oh. You met him, right? Uh, is it the the goat guy? Is it the the the, the girl with uh, the, oh. the the short hair, or is it the the the, the cat girl? Cat girl. Oh, I I haven't been with her. I think she was seasick. She was definitely not feeling well on the boat. Mm. That makes sense. Mm. Oh, um, yeah. So they're an illusionist, and I think they're going to be a good fit on Umbra. Oh, neat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're from the Southern Colonial Isles, just like me. Oh. I don't mean you know yeah. illusion magic. No. Ah, dang. Could be pretty cool. I only know, uh... What would it be? I mean, it would be pretty cool, you know? Just like, a uh, uh, poof! Uh, imaginary rock, or... Or a poof! Uh, imaginary... Oh! Varys has mm -hmm. been seeing trees all day that's not been here. Maybe that was her doing. Interesting. Maybe. I'll see if I can ask her to teach me, or something. Yeah, because we, we already we, got a lot in common, so I'm sure it's going to be just fine. Oh, a lot, a lot, a lot in common. Like, okay, like, like what? Yeah, like you know, we, we're both from the Southern Colonial Isles. Both of our families have, were, you know, exiled. They're not exiled, but you know, pushed north by the rifts. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. And her family's like a like a rich merchant family. Oh. And yeah, she's um, classically trained and like. All this stuff from a, a an, an academy, uh, I, and that's all stuff that I did too. Uh oh, I, I see. Hmm. And obviously, she you know she's um. Uh, you know, a cat Zverica, which is kind of like what I am. I mean, yeah, yeah, lion and and a cat, yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm hmm. Yeah, she does this like funny thing with like the the Madari. She likes to talk to them a lot. Oh, I, I, I guess she she can understand them. I don't think so. Um, maybe not. But you know, I kind of do that too. Like I'll sit there and I'll pretend that I know what they're saying. Oh. Because it's just fun. I I, I kind of just go after what they kind of do with their hands and see where where it takes me. Sometimes it works. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they usually gesture and bob a bunch. Yeah. But yeah, she seems really cool. I think you'd like her. <laughs> God damn. I'm insecure already about the whole... He he come from a really cool family and uh, he has to probably marry someone uh, really special. And then this girl... What's her name again? What? Shoot, I can't remember their names ever. Oh, oh. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't remember. I can't even remember their names. I, I remember Vesper because it's short. I just remember Vesper because he's kind of weird. He is kind of weird, isn't he? he Not is. in a, like a, a bad way, but like a really religious way. Yeah. Where did everyone go? I'm not sure. I, I thought there would be like at the beach. Maybe they're at the graveyard. But she, she comes swooping mm. in and I have all this come and she's a cat. A cat! God damn! I don't know. I don't really want to go to the graveyard again. Then let's ju just drink us, the two of us. Just the two of us. Uh, okay. Hmm. Where should we go? Uh, wait, I know. Hmm? To the arena. Narina? Oh, can, can we do that? We're holding so much. Oh, shoot. You're right. We can't. Okay, let's run. 
We're running. I need to run either way. There's not enough space for me on a boat. Madari, do you know where the oh. wake is? Uh, people? A lot of people? Okay, thank you. Oh, okay. We'll find it. What is it? We could go to that cave we found okay, like that long time ago. Yeah, yeah, but oh, shh. Oh, sorry. Ow! Oh! 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 Sorry. No, it's okay. <sighs> I, I didn't. I wasn't ready for you to stop. Yeah, I ran into a pole. Ah, oh, that's silly. I got the thing with Philly. That's just her joking around like, oh, you broke me hype. You find better, bigger, better bodies than me. Oh. <sighs> but now this is like serious. I He's really like... Mad. Invest in some speed training. Mm. I've been working on my muscles so much with Kaylin, Kaden, that I uh, oh. can't... Well, you can come run I'm with old, me and LaFerrell in the morning. Now. Good idea. Uh, professor, do you know where the wake is? Because we can't find it. I wasn't even invited to this wake, so you had to oh, ask me. Oh, okay. To be fair, I don't think it was an open, or I don't think it was like a closed invite thing, just so you know. Hmm. Uh, well, I don't know the location of it either. Okay, we'll check the dorms. Thanks, Professor. I learned how to lie to professors from Nell. Of course you did. God. <laughs> Despite how stupid he was, I kind of miss Nell. Yeah. You like? I wonder what he's up to now. Mm, probably something bigger, bigger and better. But still, he was kind of that annoying little brother that you just can't help but love in a way. <laughs> <sighs> you really okay. need to work on your running. Yeah, I mean, I was faster for a while, and then I got all this weight on me because Caden said I needed to up my uh, cal 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 caloric cal caloric cal cal uh, what my food intake. Oh, so eating more potatoes, I see. Guess so. Mostly just meats and stuff. Uh, I remember, one potato a day, I'm gonna watch you. Fine, I promised. Good. It's just one. Was it here? Yeah, what? Oh, yeah. Yeah, here, here. I see something in, over there. What Whoa. the? Oh, okay. Um, someone has moved in? Huh. What is it? Oh, don't go back there. Oh. Cool. Gotta move. We'll Moving. make ourselves comfortable. Uh, yeah. <sighs> it's, it's become a whole full on living space. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. It's Ooh. okay. No one can see from here. It was just it's wild because before it was like a mattress and, and a campfire. Yeah, like a single bed roll. Yeah. And now it's like fully <sighs> furnished. Desk and it. Wait a minute. That's an aqua sign. Oh. Oh, maybe aqua has been here. Hmm. Hmm. It's not fair. They can't claim this for themselves. Well, there's not a sign on the door, so... Well, sign on the wall. Yeah, there's not even a door. So, I guess in a way, they, they haven't claimed it. Beautiful. 
But why is all this stuff here? Well, it's a really cool spot, so I guess, you know. I mean, yeah, can't complain. Mm hmm. So, what is this stuff anyway? Take a look. Not sure. Mm -hmm. Kind of smell like the thing that Sky Ed would always drink, I remember. The, 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 the red stuff. Oh, wine? Is that what it's called? Yeah. Huh. What do you mean? You don't know what wine's called? Oh no, I think that's just too fancy for me. I don't know, alcohol. You know they make cheap alcohol. wine. Mmm. Mmm. Alright. I don't like the taste of it, but Not too bad. it has like a nice burn to it. Yeah, makes my chest feel all warm. And my stomach. Mm -hmm. But it's not exactly the same as what the captain gave me the other day. He has like his own rum stash. Oh, that was some good rum. Oh, really? Yeah. He said I could come back for some more sometime if I, I needed it. <laughs> hmm. What? It, it's rum. Be careful around those seafaring types. I'm sure it's fine. It's like if it was poisoned, I would probably have been dead already. Hmm. Well, this is nice. Yeah. It's good to have you back. It's good to be back. The whole sailing for days on end, it's, uh, it gets tiring. Yeah. Training day on end is tiring, too. Uh... But I have been working on, well, new spell ideas. Mm. And I, I can see you've been doing mm -hmm. new, you've gotten bigger. Yeah, I did. Mm -hmm. like, but thanks to Caden, really. Like, like real firm. Like, mm. Mm. yep. Uh, thanks. No, no problem. Oh my foot's all. Hold on. Oh. Probably all the training. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Just a little <laughs> chiropractic exercise that the Chancellor taught me. Ah. Uh, I see. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm I mean, it seems to be working. Yeah. I should probably give me some of that. I feel my, my mm. whole bag is like a pretzel. Yeah, I know what you mean. Mm. Doesn't help with the lack of sleep. Mm. I'm starting to like this stuff. Again. <laughs> Again. When was the last time you had some? Well, I think the festival. Oh yeah, the festival. God, feels so long mm. ago now. Yeah, it really does. Mm. 
probably we can have some more of those. They're nice. Yeah. It really reminds me of home. Hmm. Hmm? Oh, you saw something? Hmm? Oh, no. Just a bug. I want to swat it out of the, uh, you know, hmm. the sky. I don't think there'll be that many bugs in during the winter. Well, what do I know? That's my thoughts exactly. Mm -hmm. You look like a strawberry. Hmm. Uh. I do? I do? You do. You're all red. No, I don't. <laughs> mm -mm. Yes, you are. No, you're red. <laughs> you're definitely more red. You look like a there, sunset. There, now we're even. I, I look like a... A sunset? Um, yeah. You know, yeah. Um, you know, all uh, bright and uh, and shiny and, and 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 such. You know. Well, you look like. A snowdrift. A <laughs> snowdrift. Yeah. Like. Like your hair is snow. I'm a little drunk. <laughs> I mean, in a way, you're right. It's it's the winter fur, James. All my hair and such white. Whoops! Oh! Ooh. <sighs> no! What stop are you, it! What are you doing? I'm trying to pick up your hair well, and why? look at your hair because it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. Like you had another set of ears. <laughs> hey. <laughs> now you look like a sunflower. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, it's also gotten longer. Yeah. You want to see? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Damn, lion boy, look at that mane. <laughs> it's not that bad, is it? No, it's not. It looks good. It looks different. Hmm. It usually starts to grow really long in the winter, too. Eh, I feel that. I've been trying to keep it shorter. It looks good. Oh, thank you. I I, I, tr I cut it myself. I also had to cut uh, various... Wait, areas. really? Yeah. Hmm. Since all the back in the institution... Maybe you I should cut my hair. hair. I can do that. That'd be great, because I don't know the first thing about cutting hair. I was thinking of just taking it all and just taking my sword and going... Whoosh. But I don't know how that would turn out. Um, probably something like this, because that was kind of what I did back at the institution. But with my knife instead. Oh, well, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, matching hairs. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Well, now I'm kind of drunk and kind of tired, so... Yeah, you, you look kind of drunk. <laughs> I think we're just going to take a nap. A nap? 
<laughs> then wouldn't it be better to get back to the dorms mm-hmm. and go to bed? Nah, I'm just gonna take. Well, uh, no, no, look, 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 look. Just gonna take a no, nap. No, no, okay, you should, should probably, you shouldn't nap out here. It's getting, it's gonna get cold. The fire's going. It's fine. You, you should go back. You, you, you need to go back to your dorm. Come, come on. It's... Nah. I'm just gonna go to sleep. No, you shouldn't sleep here. Look, look at, look at me. Look, no, look at, eh. Look, look at, look at. Hmm. Sleep well, Luca. Hmm. Lion Man. Boo! Ah! Let's go to the dorms. What? What? <sighs> I wasn't actually gonna sleep out here. But, 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 but. You think I fall asleep that fast? Uh, you did once. Well, maybe. Yeah. You did. Last time you were dr- well, last time like, sometime when you were drunk. Nah. I don't remember that. Because you were drunk? <sighs> Just gonna leave that there. It's fine. It's fine. Let's go. Oh, how, how in the world am I gonna get you over these t- t- rocks? Uh, I'll figure it out. I'm not that drunk. Mm. We'll see when you fall down. And I need to rescue you, like a damsel in distress. You couldn't carry me even if you wanted to. I could so. Well, probably not now since you got all that muscly Uh-oh. going on. But before I definitely could. What? What, what are you doing? My good sir! Stop it! A calorie. Oh, I, I died! <laughs> <laughs> oh no! song you're the piano man <laughs> oh that was unfortunate oh no this is, i've been a hot man since i died i mean like really wait no i did it today no i did not i i was i reset because i wasn't talking god damn bad timing ah uh. Please let me back in. Connecting? Yes. Joining? Yes. Let me in. Let me in. Ah. I can see. No, good to him, good to him, good to him, good to him. But I hope, uh, I hope that at least, like, from how I portray him, that people at least enjoy St. Clair as a character. I got that. That's what matters to me, that people enjoy him. The only yeah. thing Morgan oh, didn't pull out was a fucking, uh, bag. Oh god, how the fuck do I get back up there? I don't know. Gotta find out, boys. <laughs> we forgot to find out. Uh, oh shit. Oh god. I was drifting. 
Maybe I'm gonna cheat a little bit here. Uh, there we go. See if I can <laughs> I can spoot in. Uh, no, I don't think that's it. Surely he it wasn't that fast. Oh, is that him? I could not see. Can't do it. Sing me a song, you're a piano man. Oh, what was that one song? I was thinking. With the with the lion boy. <laughs> I cannot remember. She's still here. Oh, I don't think so. Dang. Ah, Satch. Oh, Kalisha did. Oh no, I left. Oh, that's a shame. Oh well, I can still go and spy on him. <laughs> oh, then it probably was him that went into the dorm. <clears throat> oh well, it happens. I mean, a hot man says it happened to me because normally I'm doing okay. Oh, I don't think it Oh, I quite open. Oh, I think he he did. Well, I mean, it depends on how like if this number age wasn't able to be there to watch it. Ah, I mean, frankly, the 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 just the reaction of everyone immediately losing.